Hey guys, welcome. How do you like my new, uh, <laughs> how do you like my new background? I was giggling like a lunatic while making this shit. <laughs> it's okay, I hope they like it. I wonder what they're gonna think. It's so weird they named him Grossberg when he's like the opposite, the literal opposite of being gross. It's so weird. Why would they do that? <laughs> no, the chat. Oh god. Oh my god. I was like, yeah, giggling to myself like a lunatic and my boyfriend came in while I was like editing this. I was like, don't judge me. <laughs> don't judge me. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh good. Good times. Good times. Okay, yeah, today. <laughs> I tried to give him the lip bite, but his his mustache kind of covers it up. Also, it's kind of like yellow because <laughs> I was taking it from like a uh from an emoji. Welcome guys to the stream. Um, today we're gonna be checking out Wolf Game. Um, and yeah, I'm excited to check this out. So unfortunately, there's not like a translated version of this game. So um, we're just gonna be watching this uh, Let's Play by Blue Horror Gaming. Thankfully, they they read the you know they read the dialogue, but they also have like subs basically to uh, you know so we can like read it and kind of give voices and stuff too if we want to. So I'm gonna probably end up doing that. But yeah, shout out to Blue Horror Gaming because it's like the only translation I can find <laughs> I can find for this game. Also, if you are familiar with um, Wolf Game. I may need to mod some people because I do think I saw some people talking about spoilers already being in chat. I was like, this is kind of more of a niche thing, so I didn't think we'd have as many issues with spoilers, but uh, it seems like we might. So if you want to be a mod and you know Wolf Game, I may, I may need to mod you because I don't know if any of my current mods are actually familiar with Wolf Game. Thank you, Brian Ford. Dripberg is a great way to open up the stream. <laughs> He's so drippy, Dripberg. I love that. Oh my god, yes, my boy, my boy. <laughs> I feel like my boyfriend saw he was like why are you fucking simping over this old man <laughs> like don't judge me thank you simchan grossberg has that drip yes he does yes he does damn right he does and he always will thank you captain draken this is the first game you're streaming that i'm completely blind for how exciting yeah i was kind of wondering i feel like a lot of people might be kind of blind for this because like i said this is like the only translation i can find unfortunately yeah there was like a actual playable translation but then the company got mad for some reason which i don't know i thought it was kind of lame i talked about it in my video because i was like they could still monetize it because it was like you just added it on top of the game itself so oh. <laughs> so it was kind of strange that they i don't know didn't want it to be you know around or whatever but uh i don't know yeah it kind of stinks but hopefully maybe me playing it will hopefully get more people familiar with it and um Maybe eventually we will get an actual English translation for it because the creator said they were going to make one, but uh, I think it's been kind of uh, up in the air for a while. Or they might have decided against it because it was a long time ago. Thank you, Cherry Android. You're amazing, Weeby. Can't wait for the stream. Oh, thank you so much. I'm excited to try this out. And uh, yeah, I guess we can go ahead and get started. Um, and what company, what did company do? They just asked them to take it down, basically, because there was, like, a translation group, and they were like, no, we're going to translate it ourselves, but uh, that was, like, years ago. And they have not translated it themselves, so uh, I'm not totally sure if they ever, like, you know, plan on doing that. But, uh, okay, let's go ahead and get started then. Kind of go through her intro. And yeah, again, shout out to Blue Horror Gaming for doing this. I kind of feel bad to talk over it. To just, like, talk over it. That's about all I can do. Okay. Let's see. And yeah, unfortunately, I'm just going to kind of have to have my own music in the background for, like, um... Because, you know, I'm going to have to mute the video since she kind of talks over it. Thank you, Fallen Redditor. Check out It's Not My Time to Die by... Mick Obbins. I told you about it yesterday. Anyways, I hope you enjoy Wolf Game. It's really cool. Okay, cool. I'm glad you tried it out, too. I'm excited to to see what it's all about. Thank you, uh, CH. I've only modded on Twitch, but if you need help, I'd be down. Okay, yeah, I might I might need you. I'll see uh, kind of how everything goes, I guess. Um, if we, if a lot of other people are, um, whatchamacallit, let's see, like spoiling or anything like that. But, uh, yeah, I just have, like, Dog and Rafa music on in the background, too, because, like I said, I wasn't really sure what to do. <laughs> Hopefully it, like, you know, kind of goes well with the scenes. I can change it, I guess, as we go. But that was uh, the best I could do. But, yeah, I do like the art style for this a lot. I do like uh, the premise does seem very Dog and Rafa esque It's even got, like, the, the pink blood, so I'm excited to try it out. <laughs> okay, let's see. 
You make sure. It's like, is this? Stop. Please help me. Huh. I'm just a kid. Okay, so I think it's a girl saying this, what they said? Yuya, hmm. Why are you always mad at me? Uh huh? Why, why do you always beat me? Oh, Jesus Christ. What is going on? You used to be so, so nice to me. I want that mom back. Oh, God. Trauma dump already in the first 10 seconds. What are you talking about? I'm not, I'm not your mom. You were adopted. I'm staring at you right in the face. I'm still, I'm still alive. Um. Oh, oh God. Did we kill her? Is that, is that what happened? It, Mom. Oh my God. I feel like I'm in Milgram right now. <laughs> God. Am I hard? <laughs> it's like, it feels like a Milgram video. <laughs> Why won't you say anything? That's so weird. Again, you need one more person? Mom! Mom? Mommy? Mama? I see. It, you're asleep! <laughs> I, don't think, I don't think she's asleep! I don't think she's asleep, homie! Sorry, did it? <laughs> did it? Oh my god, I love the blood, probably. Is this supposed to be blood on their hands, like patting? I'm sorry, Mom, for putting you to sleep. <laughs> Oopsie. Oopsie. Oh man, there's a donation I missed too. Thank you, Buki. Hey, Weeby, I wanted to thank you for giving me a comfort place with your streams. Thank you for always making me laugh even on hard days. Oh, that's so sweet. I'm so glad you enjoy it. Thank you so much for the donation. I, like the comfort, uh, the comfort streams. There's like somebody dying on the stream. <laughs> that's not gonna wrap up fans for you, man. Oh man. Yeah, I can try to maybe get like a more intense music. Um, I don't really. Do like a OST kind of thing. Nope. That was like the only thing I was worried about with this. Um, so you need like oh distrust is probably good. Here we go. There we go. Distrust. Okay, guys, we got some better music now. <laughs> but I feel so hot right now. Um. Is this us? I'm covered in this feeling, mom. <laughs> what the fuck? Mom, what? Oh god, I don't like the way this is worded. I can finally be happy now. I thank you, mom, for allowing me to murder you. Oh, hey, little goat people. Are those, are those sheep? Um, huh, they're taking me to the- They're like, this guy looks like he's ready to slay. <laughs> he looks like he's ready. <laughs> On the other side of the door, there's sheep. What are they doing in a place like this? Looks like we're on like a subway or something. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's great here. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck is going on. I'm fulfilled. Goodbye, mom. <laughs> I can die now. What the fuck is going on? Okay. Oh, we were on a train, I think. <laughs> I don't understand. I'm so fucking confused. So... We weren't? So we're not that guy? Because he seems kind of dead now. My reason for living. That's what I understood it to be. Oh my god, not somebody saying Tozu in the comment section. I could never find someone to love. That was my only wish. I now am happy. You know, whatever. <laughs> what the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? Jesus Christ, this game is psychotic. Five seconds in. Oh my God, thank you, Wolf Allen. This reminded me of Corpse Factor. That's why I was thinking too. I was like, it was like Corpse Factor with the intro being so insane. Thank you, Isley Rage. I'm in severe confusion, but cool. I I think, I think, I might just loop this song for a little bit, but y'all can let me know if you have any requests for uh, DJ Weeby over here. Okay, okay, okay. 
Where am I? Uh, as I open my eyes, I'm sitting in a chair in a dark room. I'm like so confused about, I mean, there's no fucking way he died, he like survived through that, you know what I mean? POV, you are the corpse. <laughs> yeah, I like, I don't, like, like I said, there's no way, there's no way we survived that. So I'm like, is that gonna be like my, my dad or my brother or something? I don't, I don't know, <laughs> no clue. I feel like I'm not alone either. Huh. What the hell is going on? This scene gives me like major your turn to die vibes. Suddenly, a voice cries out. Is someone there? Uh, based on her voice, she sounds like she's around the same age as me. Huh. Yeah, I'm I'm here. Are you the one? Are you the one who brought me here? I'm not really sure who's saying that. No, I'm exactly the same as you! <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, right. Probably we're in the same situation. Okay, then why is this why is this happening to us? Well, to be frank. Oh my god, are we the gray man from Danganronpa? Oh my god, are we gonna slay? Oh my god, is that us? It's so dark in here that I can't I can't see anything. Y yeah. Why don't you help me look for a light switch? Um. Are you scared to walk around in the dark? Yeah. In this darkness, it's hard to tell what's going on. Okay. Well, how about you look behind me? We're gonna see what this girl looks like. Well, I've got a, I've got a bad feeling. Don't don't worry a bit. I got you. I'm ready for anything so you can start looking too. I feel like she's gonna stab me. Thank you. Okay. The girl stood up and began walking around the room. I do not trust this girl. She's keeping her nerve as she walks in the darkness. Even though I knew I had to help look around, is it was as if some spirit or demon prevented- <laughs> He's like, don't worry, small child. I got you. I got you. You. Uh, you don't have to do anything, and then he just tells her to get up and do it. He's like, nah, I'm good. I'm just gonna sit here. It's kind of scary in here. It's dark. I don't know if I want to look around. It's too dark and spooky. <laughs> oh, gosh. The girl's footsteps grew louder as she got near me. And then her footsteps came from right behind me. Hey now, it sounds like you're it, it sounds like you're right behind me. It's like why aren't you fucking do anything doing anything? I thought you were gonna help me out. I'm right in front of your eyes. Um it seemed that whatever evil power that held me there didn't stop me from speaking out. And then right beside my ear she said something. Oh Jesus Christ. Are you going to run away again? With that, I felt like time had frozen. Run away uh, again? That was what the girl had said. Run away. Oh, wait. So, Weeby, the longer name is the girl and the small one is you. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate. <laughs> I appreciate you uh, letting me know. Run away. I'm in the last. Because I wasn't honestly totally sure. I know it, like, it's going to get easier when all the characters come out. Because they're going to be on screen whenever they're talking. I think for the most part, at least. But I appreciate you. Thank you. Run away, I'm the last person you should be saying that to. But then, did this person know me from when I was a kid? Is this the person that murdered their mom? I don't remember, back then I had run away. That's besides the point. Are you upset that I didn't help you look around? I won't run away, uh, I'll help you look, okay? And just like stays sitting in his chair. Okay, now he's good enough. I slowly stood up and started looking for a light switch. I walking around my hands, walking and running my hands along the walls. I looked for a switch. I was so scared. I didn't even realize I'd been holding my breath. And then it felt like my finger struck something on the wall. Recognizing the shape, it had to be a light switch. <laughs> it's here. I'm going to turn the lights on. What does this girl look like, dude? And so I slowly flicked the switch. It's like a goat person. A light hanging in the center illuminated the room. Before my eyes was a door. Anyways, good thing, good thing I got the lights on, right? Right, bestie? 
If there's a door, then it means we can probably get out, right? Uh, so that's the girl again. But the girl behind me did not reply. Oh, Jesus Christ. With my eyes still a little blinded from the light, I turned around. But there is... Okay. <laughs> I thought she was about to stab me or something. But there is nobody there. What the hell? There was definitely someone here. I was talking to them. Yet it was clear that I was the only one in the room. No one... No one else. Then where the hell did that voice come from? Anyways, I, I gotta get out of here. I tried the doorknob. Okay. Shit, it's locked! Fuck! There's like a 999 escape mission, huh? This is... Looking closely, I can see something written on the door. Oh, it is like a puzzle or something. In a place of light is a key out. It's in the, in the light bulb or something? Uh, what is what does this mean? Yeah, I was like, she just disappeared. A ghost? I don't know, I'm kind of assuming she might be like one of the mascots or something? Maybe? Seek a way out. Yeah, that's basically my first thought. <laughs> Seek a way out. Um, thank you, Isley Rage. Mom, pick me up. I'm not scared. Just confused. <laughs> Just confused. <laughs> it is... It do be a little confusing right now, because I only really watched kind of like the... For my other video, I just watched like when, uh, you know, the mascots were explaining the rules. I didn't watch this part, and I'm like, <laughs> what the fuck is going on? <laughs> the place of light. There's a key. Uh, but where in the room is a place of light? In the light bulb? Anyways, let's look around. Okay, I guess this is just like... Basic instructions and how to use the items. You click on them and then the item you want to use, so we'll click on the light bulb. Okay, pretty easy puzzle. It seems like there's something in this light bulb. Is this a key? I found a key in the light bulb. What is it doing here? Anyways, let's try opening up this door. Okay. Man, I wish I could play this. The door opened. Let's try going out. Okay, now I think we get to meet the gang. I slowly open the door. Yay! Let me change the music, too. I don't want it to get too old. I see somebody... I think it's Wentz is like, Kevin McDonald. I don't know what that is. <laughs> I don't know what that is. It sounds copyrighted, though. Okay, maybe we'll do this song. This seems pretty good for right now. Okay. Okay, Misaki. Ah! Another came! Oh, yeah, I think I did see somebody saying, I don't know if it really matters too much if um, we have to, like, you know, delete messages that say the characters' names. So I think I just might have the names on the boxes already. But thank you, Starkid1957. Thanks for your Milgram video. I'm traumatized. <laughs> as you should be. As you should be, God. Milgram's so good. I love it. I gotta make a video soon, TM. Ah, another came! Finally, the door has opened! Chi chi -e? Okay. Before me now was a large, wide room filled with many different people. Maki, so you were broadier too, huh? Like a photographer dude? They kind of, I don't know, they all have like a Alice in Wonderland kind of vibe to me for whatever reason. So, <laughs> should I give him like a nerdy voice? I don't know why, but this guy gives me like nerdy, nerdy vibes. So that means everyone here, or maybe, maybe more of like a, what should we call it? Um, I'm trying to think. Like the show by voice? So that means everyone here has the same exact story. Y'all can just let me know what you think are good voices or not. But yeah, the designs are really nice for this game. Um, what the hell do you mean? Excuse, exactly. None of us know what's going on. Oh, this guy, he just looks psychotic, dude. Every time I see a picture of this dude, his eyes are just like, he's got the crazy eyes, man. <laughs> Everybody wants to know why we were brought here. It's like he my soul, I guess. Then uh, unexpectedly, an unsettling voice rang out from the room. Um, everybody. I think that's Wolfie Chan. Welcome to the Wolf Game. Please hurry up and sit down in a chair with your name on it. However, nobody moved from their spots and no one could tell where the voice came from. Wait a minute, guys. Please, please listen to me. Oh, who's this guy? You better hurry and let us go. I'm a cop. Oh, my God. It's going to be the KG of this game. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm calling it now. The KG. Well, even if you belong to the police, you can't leave. Okay, I think that's the wolf guy. 
Then how do we leave then? Jeez, if you keep asking questions, then there will be consequences. I will only wait 10 seconds. 10, 9, 8. Um, <laughs> but we don't even know each other yet. We're supposed to do the introductions. Come on. This is not. <laughs> uh, just in case, should we, should we listen? 4, 3, 2. Um, it, what, what if something terrible happens? One, zero. About to get zapped. You have broken the rules. Time for punishment. What? What's that weird beeping sound? The next moment, a sharp pain ran through my body. Oh, God. Oh, man. They look like, oh, it's this. It hurts. Ah! Getting zapped just like Tozu. <laughs> Make it stop. Uh, hurry, stop it. And then that sharp, sharp pain stopped. Huh, what the, what the hell was that? Something, something to make you follow the rules. That's, uh, oh, hello. This guy. Pretty lady. In the center chair sat two shapes. Okay, here's the little mascots. Is that a, maybe this guy actually does better with a nerdy voice. Is that a wolf and a, and a sheep? It's nice to meet all of you. I am one of the game's organizers, Mary. I'm Wolf. The dolls are talking creepy. Hey, what did you what did you do to us? We have attached spinal nerve device onto all of you. Are you are you serious? There's something on there's something on the back of my neck. I will warn that if it is messed with or removed, you will die. Oh. Well, you all better hurry and sit in your assigned seats unless you want to get zapped again, bitches. Well, it wasn't as if anybody had a fucking choice. <laughs> Following the orders given, we all went and sat down in our respective seats. If only you would all listen to us from the start. Well, now. Starting now, the wolf game has begun. Without, without warning, before our eyes even, cards appeared. Well, choose one card. Okay, this is the... The card shuffle. There's a very special card that will decide your fate. Our fate? What the hell do you mean by that? Even though everybody was quite confused, they all drew a card. Uh, so there's 12 people, including ourselves. I think so, yeah. It's less than like a Danganronpa game. I knew that much at least. It wasn't gonna be like 16. Sheep card! And yeah, I kinda know the rules for making that other video. Is this a sheep? The card I picked has a face of a sheep on it. Don't choose the sacrifice. <laughs> the cards you chose from have two types. A sheep and a wolf card. If you are the one who picked the wolf card, you must kill one sheep. K kill Hey, hey, do we have to go that far? Then after the wolf has slid- SLAID! Oh my god! He said the thing! He said the thing! Then, after the wolf was has slain, uh, they slayed, there will be 12 hours until the wolf's trial begins. I was, like, kind of wondering if the person we saw at the beginning, um, kind of, like, I don't know, maybe they, what's the word? Um, they're, like, one of the people in the game, maybe? Thank you, Floral Feather is becoming an ultimate supreme leader! And thank you, Isley Rage, and Borden House, so I think I'm gonna leave, bye. Thanks for stopping by and thanks for the donation, though. Appreciate you. <laughs> then after the wolf is slain and shoot, there will be 12 hours until the wolf's trial begins. Then it will be up to the remaining sheep to determine which one of you was the wolf. Then you will choose to execute one. This was like, if the wolf was executed, then the sheep will win. And a door that leads out of this building will open. In other words, in order for the wolf to stay alive, they have to continue killing sheep. The sheep must reveal the wolf in order to open the exit door. Whether you escape with your lives is up to you now. Then what happens if a wolf doesn't kill a sheep? Then in that case, they have to choose to give up their life, and the wolf will be executed. Okay, uh, no, no way! That is the entire explanation. After saying that, both Mary and the wolf dolls vanished. Remember, I kind of had, like, a theory about, like, a little bit of this, just because, like, I kind of feel like some of it was almost, um, what's the word? Like, vague on purpose? 
Like, what happens if we choose, like, if we choose the wrong person? Does the wolf just have to keep killing until, like, they kill everybody? You know what I mean? <laughs> that's kind of what, uh, that's what I was thinking. Must continue killing. I was like, I think that means that they have to just, like, continue murdering until, like, there's nobody left. That's kind of, kind of what it seemed like, but I'm not, I'm not totally sure. It is vague, and I believe it's vague on purpose. Damn it, what do they want from us? That remains a mystery. This fucking guy, dude. If we execute the wolf, they said the exit door would open, right? But I wonder why that is. Who could be the wolf this time? Huh. That unexpected question plunged the room into silence. Well, that's a reasonable response. We've already started to play against one another. Uh, already! Oh, this music kind of goes too. Do 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 do. Why do we have to do this awful thing? For the time being, why don't we all just work together and investigate? It is true. We still don't know what's going on. That's true. We should leave this room to start with. But after saying all that, we left the room together. Okay. Do do. Do do do. After leaving the room, we found ourselves in a strange room. I kind of wonder too, what is this place? What an unsettling room. Hey guys, do you mind listening to me for a sec? Back there, I said I was with the police. Just to, just to remind you, <laughs> I'm gonna start challenging KG on how many times he can say he's working with the uh, police. But something kind of wondered, because I feel like, I don't know, I feel like with these kind of death game things, it usually is like, um, what's the word? Like, they all kind of knew each other and like, I just kind of wonder if the wolves are gonna set it up to where like, okay, so somebody gets chosen as the wolf and they do they do a killing, but it's like they, whatchamacallit, like, um, kind of manipulate it to where we're gonna learn more about each other and how we're all like interconnected later, maybe? I don't know, <laughs> something like that. That's why you should entrust your safety to me. <laughs> uh, we're safe as long as the cop is here. That should be true. Well, it would be quite possible that you're the wolf then. Uh, hey, that's that's not what I meant. Then where's your proof? Uh, guys, we should work together because I'm a cop, remember? Well, well, it's no good to get riled up now if we start fighting. We'll never figure figure out who's behind all of this. Uh, um, let's cooperate, guys. If we put all our strength together, we'll surely get out. And that's a flag you'll stand. You stand for. Uh, wait, is she saying that's a death flag? That's the flag you stand for. You'll quickly die. Flag? Anyways, let's let's work together. Uh, even if we work together, isn't the wolf going to kill one of us? Are you allowed to show your card? I don't know. They didn't really say anything about that, so I'm like, I think it might technically be okay. Oh, thank you, Buki, guys. Time to spot the Mitch. There, you know, there's only one Mitch. There's only one, one Mitch in existence, and that is, and that is Mitch himself. Mitch himself. Thank you for the dono, though. Appreciate you. So they really will kill someone then. But won't the wolf get executed if they don't kill a sheep? Well, that that's if the annoying doll was telling the truth. Then the wolf will absolutely have to kill someone. Uh-oh. And the unspeakable air is settled over all of us again. Even if that's the case, we can't stop it. Why don't we try looking around this place? Yeah, search sounds fun. Well, it would be dangerous to walk around alone. How about we all pair up and assign teams to different areas? Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. I decided to go with the Kanzai dialect girl, Masaki, to the third floor. Okay, let's do it! Yeah. Well, let's quickly begin our search. Oh yeah, even still, everybody should be careful. There's no telling when something bad could happen. I kinda do wish we got like intros though, cause like, uh, it'd be nice to know everybody's, uh, you know. Oh wait, now before we explore the building, let's get to know our crew. Okay, I guess there's not like official intros, but maybe you just like, can look at their character profile, I guess. If this doesn't matter to you, please skip ahead. Now I wanna see the intros. I'm like, who are these people? <laughs> 
Their full name and age is at the top here. This is Miho. Oh, she's 31. A brilliant lawyer. She's never lost to another opposing lawyer in her career thus far. She's a very mature woman. Okay. It seems like everybody's, yeah, ages are pretty uh, broad for this one. I think uh, the the rainbow hair guy, I think his name's like Rintaro or something like that. I think he might be like 17 or something. I think he's the only one who's youngest. I think he might actually be the youngest, even though the girl with the green hair looks like she's like 15. <laughs> Takuya. He used to be a slightly famous actor, but he hasn't been popular for a long time. If the blood gets to his head, he doesn't shy away from saying off things. So he's kind of like a hot-headed, it seems like. Yeah, how is this girl 21? She looks like she's 15. A uni university student from Tokyo. With a cunning personality, she doesn't trust anybody. Not afraid to speak what she believes is the truth, no matter how bad it sounds. Even though she's 21 years old, she looks like she's in elementary school. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. Maki, a journalist for a major weekly magazine. I didn't realize that was a gender neutral name. Covering got. Oh, wait, just kidding. I thought she was a boy. No, I just misgendered her. Fuck it. Fuck. My bad. I'm so sorry, Maki. Covering gossip, she always walks around with her camera and voice re voice recorder. So she's kind of like a journalist, it seems like. My bad. I'll give her a different voice then, because I think I, <laughs> I think I gave her like a boy voice. <laughs> with her cheerful personality and charisma. Older. Ew. Older men tend to like her. Well, I guess she's 25, but you know, still. Okay. And a cult to a pun of otaku. I love it, it's great, girl. A cult girl. Okay. Goth. She always wears a school uniform, even though she's 27. <laughs> even though she's 27 years old. <laughs> the biggest reason for being that, despite getting older, she was never brave enough to go out and buy new clothes. Okay. I was like. <laughs> Why is she wearing high school clothes? She's fucking 27. <laughs> it's weird. The biggest reason being that despite getting older, uh, despite getting older, she's never brave enough to go out and buy new clothes, but I guess she's just insecure. I was like, because it's time it was like, she's trying to like play into like the, I don't know, the creepy like fantasy. Uh, you know, you know how some people are. You know how some people are. I was like, uh, but maybe, maybe she just, she's just shy. She, she feels bad about, I, I kind of get it, because like I feel like I do get kind of weird about like wearing new clothes, especially on stream. I feel like uncomfortable and stuff. She performs a daily ceremony to foretell the future. 19, okay, wow. Misaki, a kind Kansai bin girl. So Kansai bin is kind of like the Southern, oh my God. Karen voice, Karen voice. So we'll try to speak kind of Southernly with her. Okay, okay, that's the, uh, um. The girl or the person who is uh, doing the video. She's a self-proclaimed otaku of rhythm games. She likes clothes and accessories related to cosplay. She's friendly. She's friendly and cooperative when she talks. I don't know. She kind of seems sus to me. If she was the wolf, there's no way she'd ever be able to kill anybody. At least she seems to be that type. I don't know. She seems kind of sus. Even the intro is like, she's so perfect and wonderful. She would never do anything bad to anybody. It's like... <laughs> what she? What she? She's the one we're walking around with too. Co. A boy skilled in IT is talented at programming. As he taught himself, that's why he carries his laptop everywhere. With a sharp intuition. With a sharp intuition, he really doesn't want to be the wolf. He believes other people to be evil. I kind of like him though. He seems interesting. Takio, a chubby detective. He believes strongly he can protect everyone by taking charge of the place. Because of this, he isn't well liked. <laughs> He's kind of bossy. He is well versed in martial arts. If he ever was the wolf, he'd be a dangerous foe. I can kind of see him being the wolf, honestly, first. Just because, like, I don't know. I guess maybe because they were accusing him, it would be more obvious. But, like, I just feel like I could see people trusting him and being like, oh, he's a police. He's here to protect us. But, you know, he would be a really uh, scary one. A really scary one to be the wolf. Honestly, no one knows what he's thinking. Look at those eyes. He likes to talk about strange fashions. He ends words with a sing-songy voice. Okay, no, he needs to be the Mikado voice. Now, because I always do the sing-songy voice with Mikado. With his dreamlike air and his keen opinions, and his keen opinions make him stand out. I like, I do think I'm probably, I'm probably gonna end up liking Rintara the best. He just, he seems so sus. Osami, a middle school foreign language teacher, 36, wow. He seems kind, but it's hard to know what he's really, uh, it's hard to know what he really thinks. 
He really is interested in novels and small antiques. He always has his journal on him and is frequently jotting down in it. Okay, I wonder if he'll kind of... His hair is also very shaggy. I wonder if he's going to kind of be like, um, crap, Ulysses, where he's like writing down notes about everything that's going on. 33, Satoru, a gloomy psychiatrist. He styles his hair to look like his favorite idol. Oh, <laughs> Blackjack. Although he knows it's just for looks, he can't help but feel dissatisfied with it. It's kind of like the e-girl, <laughs> the e-girl split hair design. Wolf and Mary, the masters of the wolf game. Wolf has a strong personality, whereas Mary is weaker. The purpose behind the game still remains a mystery and it works quite well for this reason. Okay. Cool. That's nice that we at least kind of get to get a little bit of introduction. I do kind of miss like the, uh, well, do they have super big? I think they did do kind of like straight up introductions in Near Turn to Die to like the character describing themselves, you know what I mean? Just because I feel like when the character is like introducing themselves, they kind of, you get a better idea of like their personality, just the way they're like describing themselves and like the way they talk and stuff like that. So I had to th third floor where Misaki is, the Karen god. <laughs> Why did we go off with her? Never trust anybody from the south. What are you doing, man? Um, a stove is on. It's warm. It's not. I'm not sure why something like this is even here. Let's click on the blackboard. Uh, there is something written on the blackboard. I should talk to Misaki first, though. Man, I wish I could say it. I wish I knew what it said. This place is some kind of school classroom. I wonder why it's such a different, why it's such a different space. Yeah, it's a bit unsettling. Kind of interesting we're in a school since we're kind of older for the most part, you know what I mean? Not to mention there's a, not to mention there's a window, but it's all boarded up. Even if we were to escape through that, it would be real difficult. Yeah, also there's a vase of flowers on this desk here. What for, though? Is there something nearby to see? Huh. Weird. Hey. Oh, <laughs> what the fuck? The desk with flowers. Got some creepy-ass writing on it. This doesn't make me feel good at all. Some horrible things have been written on it. Looks like there's something inside. Huh. A colored page from a yearbook's autographs. Do we all go to school together? Maybe? Is that... Is that it? Is that why we're in a high school? The voice doesn't fit her IMO. So, well, I guess you guys can just let me know. Maybe if uh, y'all prefer the voice or not. It just said she had a southern accent, so, you know. <laughs> There's something written here. Ugh. Dear Yuya, if you were to actually die, everyone in the class would be so sad. Yuya? If you died today, we would all throw a huge party. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what? I thought you said you'd be sad. Now you're saying you're gonna hold a party? That wouldn't make sense. They're all different ages. I guess so, too. I guess so. If you die today, we would all throw a huge party. All the other classes would, too. We would be so fucking stoked. This is awful. Who would do this? Okay, so it's just like a bullying. So it's like a desk of like a bullied student, it seems like. Like, people were writing mean shit on there and they left a note. They were like, uh, maybe you should just like, you know. <laughs> we would all be so happy if you did that. I can't believe it, it's it's so mean. Oh, look over there. There's something written on the blackboard. Dear sheep, are you interested in the real me? The real me? What the, what the hell is that supposed to mean? Maybe it's trying to tell us something? Anyways, I think there there's other rooms we can investigate on this floor. Let's try that next. Okay. Huh. Will you come with me? Yeah, sure. Interesting. We got some evidence. Okay, cool. We use that for later, maybe? Huh. Or is this gonna have to do with, like, the wolf's backstory, maybe? Like... Is that... Huh. I don't know. I'm just trying to think. Because I'm like, maybe... Maybe that would be the case? Let's see. Cause like, huh, I'm trying to think. Cause we're looking through these rooms. I feel like it would make sense if the wolf ended up being the person that was like bullied, you know what I mean? And like we learn their trauma dump <laughs> during the trial to run out, you know, get sympathy for them or whatever. <laughs> Maybe. 
This room is quite wide. But the windows are blocked off here too. It seems like we can't go out of here, huh? Well, there is a lot of things in here to look at. Oh yeah, I guess we could do the investigation theme. Kind of forgot about that. Here we go. Let's see. There's a pile of papers here. This is, I don't know, I might just stick with the Karen voice. I just like doing the Karen voice. It looks like hospital papers and patient records. What are we doing in a place like this? Psychiatry, psychiatry is written here. We should show these to everyone when we meet up again. Wasn't the guy with the black and white hair, wasn't he like a doctor or something? Or like related to psychiatry maybe? Everybody should be nearly finished, finishing their searches soon. Okay, let's head back and meet up with them. Masaki and I, now with our search done, headed back to the living room. She is really pretty. Well, I think everybody should reveal what they found, if anything. There are no doors or windows on the ground floor to get out from. There's a kitchen fridge stocked with lots of food and water, though. We searched the second floor, and there wasn't any place that we could get out from either. There was a storage room with all sorts of things, like medicine. And things we're supposed to use. Huh. Supposed to use? Everybody fell back into that awful silence. Wait. All sorts of things like medicine. It's like weapons or something in there too? They kind of seem like... Kind of seem like that. Everybody fell back into that awful silence. There's no way out on the third floor? There's also a room designed to... Oh, ah, dang it, I'm getting confused with the voices. There's also a way out on the third... There's also not a way on the third floor, and there's a room designed to look like a classroom. On the blackboard, are you interested in the real me was written. The real me? What does that mean? I wonder if it's a hint. Oh, I wonder if it's a hint. Oh, yeah, I gotta get from the Mikado voice. Forgot for a second. I wonder if it's a hint on how to get out of here. And there were lots of these just left around. Are these hospital charts? Those are, oh, they are his. Oh, interesting. Those are my patient's charts. Huh, really? Why are my charts here? Could they have taken them from my hospital? What the heck is the point? Um, and there's one more strange thing. On top of one of the desks was a vase of flowers. Oh, the flowers is probably because they did end up committing sewer slide. I'm like, how do I say that one? Well, <laughs> without YouTube getting mad at me. But it kind of, it kind of seems like maybe that's the, maybe that's the case, or why there was the flowers there. The desk had all sorts of nasty things written on it. Maybe it's like one of these people's kids did that or something. I guess we'll see. Just the same as before. And who is Yuya? There's nobody here named Yuya, right? I wonder if this is just an attempt to mess with us. All we have, all we have are mysteries, huh? Anyways, I guess we can safely say that there doesn't seem to be any place we can get out, get out of here from. But now what do we do? The wolf is going to kill a sheep, right? And there's all sorts of dangerous things in that armory. Okay, so it is like weapons and stuff too. And to make sure that nobody takes anything from there. <laughs> this fucking guy, dude, he's so suspicious. I'll stand guard of the armory just to make sure. Oh, wow, suspicious. <laughs> no, I really do want to keep everyone here safe. At least everybody else is suspicious of him too. And how about you? Won't you come with me then? Huh? Me? Not particularly. How annoying. Thank you. We'll be a little bit safer with this. I'm going to go off on myself now. <laughs> okay. Death flag. You, you shouldn't. You shouldn't. We should all stay together. We'll be safe. Staying with people I don't trust is more dangerous. At least I can protect myself. Uh... Is that the flag you stand by? So brave! She's like always breaking down the fourth wall. I too am going to look around some more. I guess everyone's gonna split up then. I still need you to stay with me. I'm okay. I'm not I'm not the wolf, so don't worry. Huh. 
She seems so like, um, even if just two of us, even just the two of us is still kind of scary. And so everybody eventually split up and we went our separate ways. Interesting. And several hours passed by. That one girl with like the eyeballs. It's kind of interesting because she's like into the occult, but she's so like, um, what's the word? Like, <laughs> I don't know. She kind of reminds me of like Mekon, you know? She's so like timid and like scared of everything. Okay. Let's go ahead and get to you. Oh, the first murder, allegedly. <laughs> allegedly. Okay. Let me make sure that everything is set up. It does kind of seem interesting so far. I'm on the third floor in the large gym like room. Besides me, the others are gathered here as well. Everybody? Nobody has been killed yet. Yeah, timid, meek, some words like that. <laughs> words, all those words. If only things could continue this way. She reminds me so much of, uh, I think it was Veronica from Disturbed Time. She looks a lot like her. That's what I thought, anyways. Mysterious. Scream? Oh, okay. Scream already? From within the building, I can hear a cry ring out. A scream? Jesus Christ, they really, they really went quick. Does this mean the wolf has made their first move? God, I hope so. We all hurry, hurriedly ran towards the room where we heard the scream. That was quick, dude. Down on her knees in front of the door of the greenhouse was Misaki. Already? There! What the fuck? <laughs> we barely met everybody. They're already dead. What the fuck? Um, okay, wait. wait unless it's like a body of like a rando. Her, like an old body or something? Then we saw the light. What the fuck? We just met her! <laughs> what? Miho, got it. I knew it. Not Miho. <laughs> I barely met Speedrun. <laughs> Fucking Speedrun, dude. <laughs> I barely remembered her name. <laughs> like, no, not Miho. I knew I loved her. I loved her so much. She was pretty and she was a liar. <laughs> I'll miss her so much. So much, damn. <laughs> the fucking wolf did not take any damn time. Do why they gotta kill the hot lady too? Like, why they gotta kill the, the hot lady? That's not that's not right. Not fucking right. And there we saw the lifeless murdered body of the lawyer Miho. I think that was her name. <laughs> I don't remember. Um, was this the wolf's doing? Uh, gee, sure looks like it. I who was that lady? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's the liar lady, the pretty liar lady. I just kind of like wish I would have gotten to know her better. <laughs> I'm like, I want to be sad because she was pretty, but you know, I'm kind of like, oh no, not the hot lady. <laughs> the wolf really did slay though, Jesus. In other words, the wolf game has finally begun, right? Jesus Christ, you guys are quick at this shit. The wolf has killed a sheep. Ah, you scared me. From when we told you the rules, the wolf trial will begin in 12 hours from now. Oh yeah, that was the other weird thing. The investigation's like really long. It's like 12 hours long. It kind of made me wonder if like, maybe the wolf can like try to kill more people like uh, during the investigation. I guess we'll see. Killer really wanted that first blood perk. I'm dead. <laughs> oh my God, Biyuki. There was a body for one. I was gone for one second. I know. That was what I was thinking too. I was like, Jesus Christ. Like, turned over and I'm like, oh, somebody's dead. Oh shit. <laughs> oh my god. But yeah, I kind of wondered if maybe like a wolf could like kill during the um, investigation or if that would be like important. I guess we'll see. I guess we'll see. In other words, you have only 12 hours. Uh, only 12 hours. Only 12 hours to figure out which one of you is the wolf. So please look. Oh my gosh. Oh well then, see ya! Only 12 measly hours. The sound of my beating heart filled my head. The very first murder had just occurred. <laughs> How long have we been playing? Less than an hour? I guess, I guess we were wrong to forget that a wolf was amongst us. Yeah, yeah, it looks like the main purpose of this wolf game has started. I can't get over how quick that was. From now on, we all started investigating. Everybody for Miho's murder. I think they did say several hours had passed like in the game, but we just like didn't, <laughs> didn't talk to anybody. 
<laughs> Gotta like time skip. Oh, she's dead. Thank you, Toko. Now Wolfgang's long lost twin. Oh my god, Wolfgang's long lost twin. Wolf game. <laughs> slay, Wolf game. Oh, thank you. They it, it did slay. It did slay. And thank you, Jeff. More than 12 times as long as the murder <laughs> the murder happened. I know, right? I'm like, Jesus, this wolf is so quick. It's like, it really is like we're playing Among Us. They're just like, okay, let me try to kill everybody before they started meeting. That's usually my strategy. <laughs> Thank you, Brian Ford, mascots, the wolf game. The wolf has to kill someone. The wolf, don't have to tell me twice, dude. I'm already, I'm already fucking ready for it, bro. From now on, we'll all start investigating. Everybody for me, Miho's murder. Oh, Miho, I barely, barely knew ya. Is Miho, it's Miho, the liar's, the liar's body. It's hard to believe she was just alive. The murder really has happened. All this blood loss. I think the main cause of death. There's no mistake that a knife was used. I can't stop staring at that dead body. Even though I work as a cop, seeing a corpse still shocks me. But who could the culprit be? Did they, they didn't say how she died yet. I still have no idea. The investigation just started, bro. First of all, it'll be good to identify the knife that was used. Where would a knife be? There must be a place, somewhere in the building with knives. I'll help look too. Okay. So it seemed like she was stabbed with a knife, I think? Speed run time. Thank you, Kyoko. I barely know anyone's name. Somebody already died. <laughs> that was just so quick. I just didn't expect it. <laughs> I didn't expect it. I was like, are all the chapters this quick? I was like, I think there's like 20 parts or something. I was like, so I don't, I don't think so. I guess this just might be the tutorial, and that's why it's so quick. But we'll, we'll see. It's Miho's body. She bled profusely from her chest, so she got stabbed in the chest. Was she, was she stabbed in the chest? Why is there the stab wound here and blood spoiling, pouring out of it? Was she maybe, maybe stabbed there? Oh, how long is the imposter's cooldown? <laughs> oh my god, they got the pink knife though. That's kind of slay. There's a washed up. Uh, there's a washed knife in the sink. That's kind of sussy. It's just like the nerd guy washing the knife. I don't even know their names yet. I'm doing nothing here. Nothing, nothing suspicious here. Uh, no, 28. St no, not the 28 stab wounds. Oh my god. <laughs> 28 stab wounds was somebody using this to was somebody using this to cook oh my god probably they wouldn't do it with the pink knife it's still a bit dirty there's like blood on this were they cooking like beef liver or something that must be true these knives one of the many have been used but this knife looks like there's a bit of blood on it they must be making steak oh yeah about that the truth is last night I was a little hungry I don't know why, I feel like the doctor did it. He seems so sus. So I forgot that I asked Misaki to cook me something. <laughs> she asked me to clean it after she was done using it. I completely forgot. So, then the snipes. Uh, I don't know what voice to give this guy. So, then the snipe. Since last night was only used to cook. Maybe something like that. Kind of like the nerd voice for the other guy. Well, there's no way to roll, out, roll it out yet. I guess that's so... Yeah, it really is still a bit dirty. It's possible that it's what was used. Okay. <laughs> oh, they're always so funny in these investigation games. They're like, why is there a stab wound and a knife with blood on it? Wait, was he really cooking? I mean, there is two knives, so... Mm, I don't know. <laughs> cooking up a crime, maybe? Hmm? Hmm? <laughs> I want to look into finding the murder weapon. But my stomach has been acting up still. It's gonna pull like a Nekamaru. I got a shit! Are you are you okay? Are you okay? I have no idea why my stomach hurts so much. Was he poisoned? I just wanna do at least a little bit of investigation. Cause at first I thought he was just talking about seeing the body, but maybe somebody did somebody who cooked put poison in the food or something like that. At least it wasn't you who told them to slay, so it's not your fault. I didn't even have time to tell them to slay. They just did it. They're like, ah, fuck it. Weeby's probably going to tell me to slay at some point. This is a tactical knife, huh? Okay, maybe this one's actually the murder weapon then. But there aren't any traces it's been used lately. Really? Interesting. Uh, if they use this knife, it sure be easy to kill someone. 
But yesterday, Detective Takio and the actor Takuya were here on watch. Oh yeah, that's true. They were together. Wouldn't it have been difficult? Wouldn't it have been difficult to use one of these tactical knives then? But what if one of those wolf- one of those two was the wolf? But there were two of them. I doubt they'd not notice something as suspicious as that. It's like, yeah, I don't see why anybody would help the wolf, you know what I mean? So, auto slay- auto slay was on! <laughs> I'm fucking dead, you guys are killing me in the chat. Yeah, I guess! <laughs> then what if both of them are in on it? Well, you shouldn't be so quick to assume that. Unless they, like, knew each other from the past or something. Yeah, yesterday those two have a pretty strong defense. We should still look into it, though. Dee 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 Ah, I love this song, man. Wait, someone in the bathroom? Oh, hey, I think it's the detective guy. I think he did get poisoned or something, honestly. Takio still hasn't come out from the toilet yet. Is something up with his stomach? I'm just sitting here listening. You know the usual. It's definitely, definitely nothing weird. You know, that's a perfectly normal thing to do. Yeah, seems to be. Oh, speaking of that, late last night, Takio, too, had to go to the bathroom then, too. Maybe the stress upset his stomach. No, no way. There was a time last night. I don't know why it kills me that we can fucking see him on the toilet. I feel like I'm intruding on his personal space. There was a time last night when Takio left to go to the toilet. Is that, is that sussy? I guess it would be like an alibi to like go, um, I don't know, like go slay on the sidelines maybe. In other words, that means Takuya had been left all alone in the armory. Oh, that's true. Oh, hey, an ad. So it actually would make Takuya sus. Interesting. Interesting. Guys, don't tell Rintaro to slay. He's gonna do it. My stomach's been hurting since yesterday. Having such cramps is really rare for me. I wonder if did Takuya feed him somehow? Are you okay? I will be. Wonder if it's just the tension from being in this place. The wolf was the ad. <laughs> it's like, man, I'm not getting paid by Amply. I don't want your ad to come up on my stream. I need to ask him about the events regarding their defense from last night. Uh, Takuya, Takuya. Huh? What, you woke me up for my nap? Uh, sorry, I just want to ask you something about the time in the armory last night. What for? How annoying. Yesterday you were with Takio. You were with- Yesterday you were with Takio yes, yesterday, right? Oh wait, let me, uh, thank you, Kyokuro. The rainbow Teletubby cannot be the wolf. I don't know, dude. I think he's the fucking mastermind. <laughs> honestly, he's so sus. He seems so, so suspicious, honestly. Yesterday you were with Takio. Yeah, what about it? During your watch, didn't Takio go to the toilet, though? Did somebody say Takio Bell? Y'all are too fucking- Y'all are too fucking much of the chat. <laughs> he had some Takio Bell. Oh my god, I'm fucking dead. I'm fucking dead. Y'all are always so, un so unhinged. Well, yeah, he did go. I see. Hey, are you accusing me of something, bro? Uh, no, not really, but kind of sus, bro. He was the only one on the toilet for- He was only on the toilet for a short time. There's no way I'm the killer. Moreover, I have an alibi. I also went to go take a dump. Alibi? Back when I was alone, that glasses-wearing old man came in to check on things. Not that- the old- Not the- Like the older guy with like the glasses and like the crazy hair, I think. That's why there was never a time I was completely alone when I was on watch. Oh- uh, Oh, really? <laughs> Hurry up and go away! I'm fucking tired of you accusing me, dumbass! <laughs> Sorry. He kinda is hot-headed like, uh, Leon. He kinda does remind me of him. So it looks like when Takuya was alone, that he was seen by somebody else. Is this true, though? He certainly had no problem bringing it up. I guess we should check with the other guy, at least. The, pl the poor blat room. Everybody was in the blat room. Okay, yeah, it is that guy. The curly hair. He looks so much younger. Well, I don't know, 36 is pretty young still. Um, Osamu? Yes, w what is it? About the watch from yesterday. Is it true that you visited the armory and saw Takuya on his own? 
Oh yes, I I did visit. That what what there was only one person. I didn't know that. And unexpectedly, he was keeping watch quite seriously. Is that so? Thank you. Yeah, but was he there the whole time? Everybody's trying to solve it. I too have inspected the body, and to be honest, I found something interesting. Huh? Huh? What is it? Look, if you look at the body closely, they're actually... Oh, guys, there wasn't even a single stab wound, and y'all were saying there was 28 of them. There actually isn't even a single stab wound. The killer, how did they, how did they do it? If what you say is true, that'll put everyone's hair in a twist. If what he says is true, there should be evidence of this? So wait, so there's not even a single, not even a single, now the fuck did they kill her? Wait, if you look closely, there wasn't, but wait, I thought we said there was a stab, I thought there was a stab, oh, I'm so confused, I thought there was a stab wound. Maybe I'm just a Lulu. Zero, zero point twenty eight stab wounds. <laughs> Y'all are so stupid. <laughs> I love it. Never change, chat. Never change. <laughs> if what he says is true, there should be evidence of this. <laughs> okay. It was just like, why do we think she was stabbed in the first place? I can't remember. Why is this part of her wrist swollen? Was she poisoned then, maybe? I don't know. It's hard to see with all the blood covering it. Because there was like a bunch of blood on her. So I'm like, where's the blood coming up from if there is like zero stab wounds? You know what I mean? Because she could have vomited blood or something, maybe? I guess so. Certainly, if what I saw was true, then the fact that this part of the arm being swollen is unnatural. Takio Bell would never do this. Are you sniffing for Takio Bell, Jeff? This is interesting, but I can't see this with all with all this blood. Is there a way to make this body part easier to see? Okay, I guess we could like clean it or something. That kind of messes up the evidence, though. Like the sanity of the bot or sanctity of the body. Something that could wipe the blood off. Maybe a cloth or a towel. Okay, I'll go get one. Thank, thanks. Where could I find, where could I find a cloth or a towel? The blat room, yay. Okay, he left at least. Here's a cloth, I can use this to wipe the blood. Oh yay, Cashman Casino. <laughs> oh gosh. Hey, what's he doing? Kinda like hunched over or something. What are you writing? Oh, I'm just recording today's investigation. What a meticulous person. Oh, oh, you've gone and brought a cloth. Let's hurry and wipe away that blood and see. Unless she cut her wrist or something. Th thanks for the cloth. Then let's then let's hurry and wipe it away. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it looks like a really tiny hole then. Huh. It's like pinched like a nerve or something. I don't know. This is what? What the heck did this? There's a small hole in her arm here. It looks like an injection site? Injection, why is this here? This is suspicious. Perhaps the wolf injected her with something? Huh. But I thought a knife was used to kill her. What could have been used to make this injection wound? I, there is like a hospital area, so I guess they could have gotten it from there maybe? Yeah, like a syringe or something? Wherever, do we have anything that can do that? Okay. <laughs> do, 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 make the 28 stab wounds. 28 injections! I like how everything's pink in this game. Oh, there's needles in here. Oh, one was taken. Huh? There's... Looking at this case, it looks like one of the needles is missing. Then does that mean the injection site on Miyoho's arm was from this needle? So they injected her with Takio Bell, I see. In other words, somebody injected Miho with this. Well, that person had to have been the wolf. But why do this? Huh. Oh, sleeping medicine in here too. Okay, so they put her to sleep first, I guess? And there's two. No, three tablets have been used. Okay. 
Who could it who could have used these? I decided to take the sleeping pills with me. Oh wait, what are you doing? Oh, you startled me. What are you doing over here all sneakily? Nothing in particular. All sussy. She probably saw me hiding the sleeping pills. You hid something! Show me! You sussy baka! No, it's it, it's really nothing. What? Sleeping pills? Some have been used. Doesn't that mean you're the wolf? Uh, no way, can it be? Would this little wimp be the wolf? We don't even know anything about the main character yet. That you gave someone the sleeping medicine? Oh, oh, hey, oh, we gotta defend ourselves. Oh, interesting, that's kinda cool. How do I, who is given? Oh, that's cool, we don't know, we just found them. Oh man, I wish I could play this game, that's cool. There's like a little defense thing where you can defend yourself. We don't know, I, I, we just found them. Only just found these sleeping pills. Oh, oh, you two, ah, <clears throat> man. Oh, oh, you two just found these, huh? Oh, I guess Masaki's still with us. Since you're here, I believe you. But you better not do anything else even remotely suspicious. Yeah, I'll be careful. Thank goodness, I can't be doubted now. Well then. When I first came to this room, there was this blood bag here. Oh, did somebody pour blood? Why? Why is there a blood pack here? Okay, so is that is that what it is? The blood bag? They just tried to make it look like she was stabbed by putting, like, blood all over her, I guess? Even though they were trying to get us to kill one another, they want us all to fight until we die, too. No. No way! Ah, uh, no way! That must be it! This is just a bad joke. I'm gonna continue to look around this room for now. And then Ritsu began to look through the room more. It sure doesn't help that my suspicion of Ritsu is growing. And more and more especially, there's that missing needle and Miho's injection point. I kind of think it's the doctor. Like, I don't know. He would be the most likely, I feel like, to know where to inject, you know what I mean? I don't know, I guess we'll see. Wonder if there's any more evidence that can be found. Oh, we're almost done with this episode too. Mio was killed by one of us. The wolf in the evidence will reveal the truth. The fucking truth. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Is it trial time already? <laughs> this game is so uh, quick. Let's fucking go. Okay. He's not a doctor though. What, what was he again then? He has a doctor coat on. Well then, everybody. The 12 hour time limit for the sheep to find the wolf is over. Oh, uh, what is he? Was he a scientist then? No, he had patience though, right? Because when we got the, um, whatchamacallit, when we got the papers, he was like, oh, these are my patients or whatever. That's why I was like thinking he was a doctor. You skip, I didn't skip an episode, did I? No, yeah, I didn't skip an episode. No, yeah, I don't think so. It says I watched all of them. Oh yeah, he's a psychiatrist, that's what it is. No, yeah, this is it. Okay. No, it just moves really fast. <laughs> okay, let's do the trial, I guess. Time to find out who ordered the Takio Bell, a psychiatrist. Oh, okay, that makes sense. I feel like you might still have knowledge of where to inject Takio Bell? <laughs> I think. I don't fucking know. And now the wolf trial begins! The 12 hours really flew by. <laughs> We're really doing this. Looks like it's time for us to discuss things. I hope we don't feel that awful electric shock again. Okay, in this wolf trial, everybody must declare who the wolf is. Are we gonna discuss, like, in Danganronpa? And then that chosen wolf will be executed. So we definitely have to sacrifice one person, as you've said. That is the rule. Even if the- then if the wolf was executed, the door will- out will open. To the next area, we're gonna do this shit again. Everybody, let your reasoning come through. And so we let the first wolf trial commence! Okay. Okay, cool, we're entering the wolf trial grounds. Yay! Oh yeah, let me get some trial music going, actually. 
Remind me to unmute this video whenever we get to like the execution. Oh, here we go. Okay. And, and now it's begun. Yeah, but I'm hesitant to start anything. If we could find the wolf, we'll be shown a way out of here. Yeah. But who the heck is the wolf who killed Miho? First, we should look into the case details. Last night, Miho was found dead, chest covered in blood in the greenhouse. So probably was just the blood pack. The murder weapon was missing from the crime scene, it seems. And Miho's body was found by Masaki, who alerted us all to come by her scream. I know, Rintaro's jacket's awesome. There wasn't any clues as to who had done it. I wonder why the wolf didn't leave any easy to understand evidence behind. Maybe it was to keep up in that dark? Keep us in the dark about the what murder weapon was used. Yeah, there wasn't anything left for us to find. So a murder weapon that no one could find. The murder weapon was a knife, right? For example, the bloodstained kitchen knife. So I guess that was all just like a ruse. Eve! Uh, everybody's a dumbass in this game too. You love to see it. You love to see it. I guess I'm just gonna go ahead and retitle this episode too, since there was already first death and trial. <laughs> first death, execution, trial. <laughs> maybe I'll just maybe I'll just leave the title the same for now, and I'll change it to trial and stuff later. I thought so too, we did not find a blood-stained knife. If the culprit was, use a knife, then after the crime, they took the knife back where they got it from. I was thinking that too. Whereabouts in this building are there knives? In the kitchen, in the armory. Well, my thirst, first thought about where a knife would be is a kitchen knife, right? Yeah, a kitchen knife, something like that could slash and kill! Stop with such scary things. We actually don't know who the MC is yet. We haven't like seen them at all and we haven't been given like a name at all for them either. Um, well, is there evidence? Another place with knives? <laughs> Trial discussion, continue. The armory. <laughs> the wolf thing. Blah, good select. Oh, he's crying. Look at him. Oh, look at him tremble. <laughs> Just call it his Wyatt. What, 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 what was Junko's thing? Ah, oh, look at him tremble. <laughs> we can't forget the tactical knives in the armory, right? Yeah, that seems like seems like a knife that cuts good. Anybody would be able to use something like that with ease. We haven't missed anything else, though, have we? We've gone through and considered it all. We haven't missed anything. I'm sorry. Maybe I'll give her more of a Mekon voice. Don't apologize, man. You're depressing me. <laughs> Sorry. Anyways. We, well, returning to the subject, the culprit had to have gotten the knife from the kitchen or the armory. But which one? Not gonna call him a noob? That's so mean. That is indeed something to think about. But wait a second. The kitchen knife most likely wasn't used. What are you talking about? Well, yesterday I was a bit hungry, so I asked Misaki to cook me something. Oh, yeah, I did. Then, so then during that time, the knife was being used by her. This was the same time as the murder, too. I planned to clean the knife, but I forgot to do so. The dirty knife was still in the sink. If we consider this, the kitchen knife was still in the sink because it was dirty. Which, I mean, uh, what kind of sicko would use a fucking dirty knife for a murder? Who would do this? Means the chance of it being used in the crime is zero. To that, to add to that, I saw the dirty knife in the sink. I mean, there's other knives though, aren't there? But wasn't there like not a knife wound on her? I thought, I thought that was something we, we confirmed as well. Then we have to eliminate the kitchen knife as a possibility. Well then, in conclusion, the knives from the armory had to have been used. But was there- I, I thought they said there wasn't a stab wound on her. But wasn't the armory being guarded? Because it, it seemed like they just did the blood pack and they like poured it on her to make it look like she'd been stabbed with a knife. It's like- I, I think that was something they said, right? How would anybody- how would anyone have been able to get a knife? Yeah, he was in charge of guarding the armory. Okay. The doofuses! Ah, the wolf, he's so scared! Good select! 
the knife was stained with Takio Bell, yeah, you know. Having to cut up those tacos, it really, really dirties up a knife. It was Detective, it was Detective Takio and the actor Takuya who were on watch. Literally no stab wounds, and they're like, De I know, that's what I was thinking. I was like, am I Delulu? I thought that they said there was no stab wounds. <laughs> it's like, how stupid are these characters? <laughs> they're like, they just see blood, they're like, must be a knife. <laughs> so true, bestie. <laughs> So true. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. I was like, I could have sworn we could confirm that, but I was, I was born stupid. So I was like, maybe I read it wrong. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Yesterday, the two of us guarded the armory. <laughs> okay. And nobody suspicious even came, of course. That a knife from the armory wasn't used then. You two sure had a vigilant watch, right? Um, you two? Here we go. Use more evidence. Tokyo Bell, take that. <laughs> Good select. I gotta remember that Junko line. That was so funny from the DR3 anime. But I heard about that. He was too busy pooping from the Tokyo Bell. I also saw Tokyo in the toilet yesterday. I was outside the whole time. But wasn't he in there for a long time? Well, yesterday my stomach was unexpectedly hurting me. So yeah, for a little bit I had to use the toilet. And can you be more specific about just how long exactly you were on the toilet for? I want I want all the details! I don't really remember, but probably about 20, 20 minutes. So long! I couldn't help it! My stomach just acted up, man! Have you ever had Taco Bell? It's like off-brand Taco Bell. It's fucked up. So you mean you left them all? Left them alone for 20 minutes. Wouldn't that have been an opportune time to steal a knife? But was there really a person who <laughs> Why are we still talking about the knife? <laughs> oh god, we're still talking about the knife and there's no knife. <laughs> no knife wound. Oh god. You know, I thought I was born stupid. <laughs> oh gosh, well there really was a person. Was there really a person who could have taken a knife for really? In other words, Time limit. Tack him with a square. Make him scared. Kind of like the intense music for this part, too. Oh, gosh. Takuya, right. He was seen. Me, why would I take a knife? Oh, really? What's with the worried face? Couldn't the crime have been committed in about 20 minutes? I would never do something like that. Well, you do kind of look sort of like a villain, though. I know who I'm voting for. Oh, what the? Okay, okay, okay. Now you're suspicious, girly. Then again, then again, these characters were these characters were born stupid, just like me. They're just like me for real. <laughs> just like me for real. I've never related so hard. Guys, the Aroha Kenny game. We found it. This whole cast is Aroha Kenny. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was thinking. <laughs> they do. They are all Aroha kitties. Oh, that reminds me. There's uh, the SDRA2 Omake mode. I kind of forgot about that, but maybe we could stream that soon. I think there's like a video translation of it if, I, if I'm if i aware. I know who I'm voting for. Hurry up and execute him. How could you How could you say such a thing? Ig, uh, I'm sorry. It just goes from like a Mikon to Kazuna. I was always on guard. I never moved from that spot. Where's your proof? Proof? Ah, oh, shit, we're supposed to have proof in this game? Uh, when I was on my own, Asamu, uh, uh, Asamu came to the armory. Aroha Rump. <laughs> I'm dead. I certainly, I did certainly visit both the kitchen and the armory then. But I was only in either location for no more than 10 minutes each. In other words, he was only alone for a few minutes. I like this song too. See, isn't that what I'm saying? Moreover, I had no way to know when Taki would come back from the bathroom. With those circumstances, there's no way I could be the fucking killer, doofus. Jay, that does make sense. Then a knife from the armory wasn't used. <laughs> How the heck did the wolf kill then? Ah, my brain. My brain. I can't handle this. Yeah. Was there another knife? Oh, that reminds me. I found something left behind in the hallway. Please, God, let's talk about the syringe, please. Look here. It's like a broken piece of the syringe, maybe? A shard of glass. I feel like I've seen something like this before. What the heck is 
What the heck was this glass shard from used for? It, what does it matter? It's too small to kill anybody with. Yeah, definitely. Okay, I kind of wondered if the trial was honestly going to get concluded. <laughs> like the entire 10 minutes. Okay. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's uh, continue on. I'm just like, please, can we please move on from, from the knife? I would, I would like to move on from the knife and talk about the syringe. Um, when I was performing my own inspection, I found something interesting. What? And when I was inspecting her body, the culprit did not leave a stab wound. Bro, you didn't. We've been talking for like 20 minutes, homie. You did not want to say that earlier. <laughs> Bro, we've all been fucking like dumbasses talking about like, was it this knife? Was it that knife? Was it this knife? And he's like, oh yeah, now that I now that I remember it, there wasn't even a knife to begin with. Ha, <laughs> suckers. <laughs> fucking suckers. <laughs> Bunch of Roha kinnies now. I was like, am I the only one who remembered that? <laughs> I have to like. Have to remind the main character about it, but no, he remembered it too. He just didn't feel like saying anything because her chest is covered in blood. Shouldn't there be some sort of cut? Uh, I don't even know why we assumed there was a knife because there wasn't a knife there. It was just a bunch of blood. They were just like, I see a lot of blood here. Yeehaw, must have been a knife. <laughs> must have been 28 stab wounds. Yeehaw. That makes sense. And there also isn't any blood in her hair. 0.28 stab wounds. Then how did the culprit get close enough without getting noticed and killing her? Wow, they must be a ninja! Is that really possible, though? No, I don't think that's it. Are they still are they still saying that she got stabbed? <laughs> There's blood there! She must have been stabbed! They cannot fucking drop it, huh? <laughs> like, how did... How did she manage to stab her without stabbing her? <laughs> the fucking wolf is like, oh my god. Jesus Christ. Was it you, Mary, who got all the ro Aroha kidneys? Uh, was Mew actually killed with a knife? <laughs> but what else could have been? But her chest is covered in blood! I thought we decided she had. I thought we decided she had to have been. I thought we decided she had to have been stabbed. No, we still it. Still haven't confirmed anything yet. Oh man, even just the conditions on acquiring a knife. These guys are making a roha look smart. Acquiring a knife and there is no stab wound to be seen, and we still have much to determine. <laughs> Prove Miho wasn't a ghost. <laughs> Gonna get the ghost. The ghost option. <laughs> Then where the blood come out from? Stop with all that! <laughs> Stop with all that fancy talk! I am just a wee little small twenty-one year old. Should we examine the body? <laughs> I got a southern accent too. All of a sudden, I can conduct a ritual to ask her for her permission. How, how do you keep missing the big picture? Oh god, I'm gonna really get her ghost out. Her ghost. Her ghost. I'm summoning her. She said that I did not do it. Slay. She said to vote out. I don't know that guy. <laughs> that one guy who we don't know the name or appearance of and we're not questioning it. <laughs> Certainly, there must be some sort of wound, right? Well, since there's blood, that means some fatal wound must exist. I think it's improper for a man to look so Maki and I will perform the inspection. I like how the main character is just not doing anything. Even though we saw the needle wound, we're just like, eh, <laughs> they got it. They got it. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so we should look around where all the blood is. Okay, we should look around. Uh, yeah, um. <gasps> oh, it's true. Wasn't Misaki with me when we saw the the little, like, you know, place? I guess they're just trying to figure out where all the blood came from. So maybe, maybe that's why she's not bringing it up. It's true. Blood didn't come from her at all. I can't believe this! And it's decided. Miho doesn't have a fatal stab wound. Oh, thank god. Thank god we're over that part. Then how'd the wolf do such a thing? That's... Duh, duh, duh. Time to truth bomb on them. What? Why did the wolf cover the body in blood to make it look like a knife was used to kill her? Blah. I feel better about it if there was actually just like a knife, like around, you know, that they also put blood into. 
But they didn't do that, you know? So I just kind of thought it was weird. I guess, like, you would automatically assume it was a knife just from the blood, but... I was like, man, these people really didn't want to, like, investigate her body at all. The wolf wanted us to believe that a knife had been used to kill her. If so, then the only two people who were guarding the knives in the armory would be suspected, right? Okay, so we can clear them at least. That makes sense. Seriously, someone tried to make me look guilty. So smart! The only smart one in this room right now is the wolf! It's like, is the wolf kinda... The wolf is kinda smart for targeting the, um, for the lawyer. Targeting the lawyer, right? Well, then if she wasn't killed with a knife, then how was she killed? Hum. Was there a way to kill someone without anything from the armory? And without leaving a single wound on the body, too? It seems, it seems impossible, but... Okay. Tap on the suspicious part. Ah, the wolf, he's so upset. He's like, no, damn it, I thought this was all the Rohawk Kennys here. <laughs> Why are they thinking? No. Her left wrist, is that it? Okay. Oh no, not again. Oh, he robbed the left wrist again. Damn it. Okay. Let's see here. On her left wrist, there was a small injection point. Really? It's true that it had been covered in blood, so it was hard to find. It's true. What? What is this from? The syringe. Slay. Slay. A syringe. Oh, the wolf is fucking freaking out right now, man. Doesn't it look like it came from a syringe? You sure say that, but... Then Miho was injected with the poison and killed. Still, if I assume that it's unlikely, there is another injury on her body. We never really talked about the blood pack either, but something like that does exist. There is an infirmary on the third floor with medicine boxes with needles inside. And not many people here would know if the medicine was safe or not. The chances of someone not knowing that this was indeed a poison is very high. Oh, then what about the broken piece of glass we found from earlier? Could it have been broken off after the killer had used it? I guess so. Interesting. Then her looking like she had been stabbed in the chest was just a fake out. But that blood looks like the real thing. Where the hell did it come from? Oh, that reminds me. <laughs> I didn't feel like bringing this up earlier either. Couldn't it come from the blood bags I found at the third floor infirmary? And they just dumped it onto her chest afterwards? Then it was all to hide how she was truly killed. Then the wolf killed her without using a knife then. Then by that reasoning, who could have used a knife? Then those who could have used a knife are the least suspicious, right? How clever! But isn't using a needle difficult for the average person? That's why I've been thinking it's the psychiatrist guy. Yeah, does anybody even know how to inject into a vein? Yeah. This is a key point here for the wolf, though. In other words, the culprit. Do we actually choose the culprit now? Is used to using needles. Take that. Good select. Oh my god, he's crying, screaming, and throwing up right now. The wolf. It has to be somebody who's very skilled at using needles. Just like our, <laughs> just like our psychiatrist, Satoru. Um, me, even though I'm a doctor, I, I, I didn't kill anybody. But with these conditions, you're the only one who fits. Oh, how rude. That's not very nice, okay? <laughs> this fucking guy with the monokuma hair. Couldn't you have used a needle to commit the murder? Uh, me? You don't even know my name. But even as you say, I am a doctor. And I am used to using needles. But why would a wolf decide to kill that way? Yeah, I don't know, man. Certainly not many people would know how to use syringes correctly, right? Then what about Detective Takio? Hey! Why me? As a police officer, don't you see syringes being used often during work? I even know what's safe or poison, too. Even if I did see it, there's no way I'd learn it from just watching. But he's cleared because he was the one he was one of the people guarding the gun area, you know what I mean? Oh, oh I'm sorry! 
However, it kind of seems like she does get brave sometimes, but then she like backs down again. The fact remains that she was killed with a syringe. If the killer was a doctor, it seems off to use that unique skill. You you agree? That's that's right. It's too suspicious. Since I've used countless needles, any amount of struggle would make a syringe impossible to use. Ah, uh, the sleeping pills. <laughs> he was too busy shitting anyways, that's so true. <laughs> that's why using a needle to kill someone is impossible. Was he the guy... Was it him or was it the other guy with the, the glasses who was having a sandwich being made by, like, Misaki? I can't remember. So I was, like, trying to think if he would have poisoned, you know, uh, Takio with the Taco Bell, too. That is an important fact you bring up. It'd be impossible to use a needle on someone if they resisted even a bit. Hum... There really wasn't a way to keep her still, though. What? That's an impossible feat! <laughs> a way to keep her still. I... I got it! If what Rintaro was implying, then Miho was immobilized somehow. Well then, how was she... Well then, how was she immobilized then? Let's fucking get him! Execution time, baby! Good select! Oh, well, music's turning up too. Mio was given sleeping pills and was asleep when it happened, right? On the third floor infirmary, we found sleeping medication. And two, no, three had been used. You fucking knocked her out. She's right, I saw it too in my own eyes. So Satori, so Satori used these and put Mio to sleep? Ah, that reminds me. I do like the art a lot for this game. It's very uh, stylistic. Even like these little kind of like, uh, you know, smaller, like, cutscene ones I like. Look really nice. That reminds me, I saw Saru get, Satoru getting Mio some coffee that night. Yeah, about that. Satoru asked me to make him some coffee yesterday. Oh. Is that why he's three to, like, uh, kind of offset the coffee? Why are his legs built like that? He did kind of have a, a funky uh, standing position. But I assumed it was for him to drink. Oh, damn it! I'm suspicious. How did you- how do you plead, Satoru? You've got it wrong! You're remembering it wrong! But I remember it exactly! She's always crying. Shut up, shut up! Oh, oh! I really do remember it right! I remember now! Back before my stomach started hurting. Satoru- <laughs> Yeah, this fucking dude. Satoru came and gave me some coffee. Ah, uh, it wasn't the Takio Bell. He must have slipped something into a drink as well. Um, trying to talk your way out still? You gave Miho the sleeping pill-laced coffee to knock her out. And then after, you injected her with the poison. Next, you dumped a bloody ba a blood bag on her chest to hide the fact to make it look like a knife was used. All that was left to do was cast down to the fact that Takuya was on guard duty alone. Oh, um. Your knowledge of needles and giving both Miho and Takio coffee. Uh, the coffee was from Takio Bell. Ugh. Oh, my bad, my bad. Isn't that all a bit suspicious? Oh, I'm not the wolf! It's absolutely not me! But there isn't another more plausible theory! Satoru Bucks? Then it's decided, right? Uh, chop chop! Have you chosen Satoru as the wolf? There is no objection here. Yes, I too think Satoru is the wolf. There is no mistake. No, no way! Then if there are no objections, the execution. Oh god, it's good. We don't even get a trauma dump though? Come on. I want a trauma dump though, my boy Satoru. Before we get, before we see him get executed. Okay, it does seem like we're about to get the punishment time though. Let me double check that the audio is gonna be okay. I hope you guys are having fun. God, already an execution. We're an hour and 30 minutes in. <laughs> I could do two chapters if I wanted to in a one stream. Maybe more. Shit. Okay. Shit, I'm not the wolf. Not the wolf. No. No. Okay. Up, oh, here we go. Well then, let us start the execution of Satoru as the wolf. Well then, let us start the no, execution of no. Satoru as the wolf. I'm not the wolf. I'm, I'm not, not the wolf. I'm not a killer. The fact that you're a. Do
The fact you're a doctor that killed makes you the worst. Since this game, this time it's a doctor, we've set up a fitting execution. Oh, it is going to be like that. Hey, Ducky, aren't you a cop? You can, you can stop this. This is how justice should be. Is this how justice should be handled? Stop this injustice. Hey, hey, do something. Aren't you a cop? You're not going to help me out, bestie. Okay, let's begin the execution. Stop! Okay. Hope you guys can hear it okay. Oh, shit. Oh, interesting. You get fed or something? Oh, <laughs> pills. Get up. Interesting. Eat it all, the ceiling will stop. The ceiling. Oh, the ceiling's coming down on him? Is that it? Interesting. Seconds. Seconds. Oh, but Kento has to eat the poison. So he has a choice. Eat the poison or get crushed to death. Holy shit. Oh! It's not quick enough, bestie. Oh! Interesting. Oh, the execution was cool, though. Oh, fuck. <laughs> He's in there now, squished like a little... Like a little blueberry. Okay, cool. That was cool. That was a really good execution, though, I gotta say. I like the execution. That was good. I kind of wish we got to know him better, though, is the only thing. Like, uh, before, uh, before, but the execution was really cool. I gotta say, I did enjoy that a decent bit. Let me, I guess I'll put the other music back on. Oh, shoot. Oh, <laughs> so loud. Oh my god. I don't think it's as loud for you guys. I had to turn it up a lot. The video is pretty quiet. I don't know how I feel about that song. Let's do a different one. That was pretty interesting, though. Where is the blood? That was crushing. Yeah, I like the design. I like the, des I like the designs. I, like, I'm not totally sure how to feel about it so far. It's just, it's going by so quick. I feel like I can't really, like bond with the characters you know that's kind of the main main complaint i have about it so far because you know it's not around but you get to like know everybody pretty well beforehand but this one i feel like i i couldn't even remember mio's name <laughs> when she died oh the graphics look better that was they really did execute him that was that was so sad you should not concern yourselves with the lives of others this time, was the person you executed the wolf, though? Who knows? If you answered correctly, a door shall open. If not, it's just like they keep killing. Then everybody is your heart ready. Then with that correct, we will see. It's probably correct. I mean, come on. Wolf or sheep? Do you get a little, like, themed execution even if you're a sheep? Keeps going. Woo! Wait. Wait, did we did we get it wrong? What? Okay, okay, I was like, it was kind of pausing for a second, so I was like, uh, did we get it wrong? Everyone was correct for the deduction that Satoria was the wolf. Thank goodness. His target was given the sleeping medicine laced with drink. And then when they were asleep, they injected the target with poison. Then the body was covered in blood. From that blood, the bag made it look like, okay, we did th th the constipation medicine. I'm speaking very fast in order for the others to be left alone and be suspected. This way, he had hoped there would be no doubt as to who had killed her. A risky plan. But did you really have to kill him? Wait, are we the ones who killed him? But he had killed Miho the lawyer. It was justice. Either way, I hope we never have to do that again. After saying that, everyone fell into that uncomfortable science, silence. Yeah, it's kind of interesting. They reveal it after they execute them, too. I feel like it kind of would be better if they revealed it maybe before. Because, like, uh, it'd be kind of, you know, I don't know. It'd be kind of fucked up if, like, they actually voted a sheep and they're like, Ah, you're wrong! And then they, and then they execute 
execute an innocent person right in front of you and they're like, well, I guess the wolf will just have to keep trying. It does seem very biased, like, towards the wolf to, like, not win, you know what I mean? Like, I feel like winning a Danganronpa, ex like, trial or whatever as the culprit is already pretty tough because it's like you have to convince everybody that you didn't commit the murder, which is difficult. But at least, like, it feels like you have more of a chance of, like, winning the game and escaping, you know what I mean? I feel like the wolf, they just kind of implied that it's like, oh, you just gotta have to keep, you know, keep, uh, keep killing until everybody's dead. Anyways, our reasoning was correct. So the way out will open now. Correct, since the wolf execution has finished. We shall open that door. Do you guys want to play another chapter or we'll see? We didn't, don't get to like the characters or even Because, <laughs> yeah, I was like, I don't know. I don't know how to feel about this game so far. It's like, I really like the art. I think it's really pretty. But I guess, like, it's just so rushed. Like, so rushed. I feel like I just have no way to bond with the characters. You know, it's like, it kind of reminds me of, um, whatchamacallit, like, uh, the Danganronpa 3 anime. Like, the, what was, like, the death game they did with, like, all those characters from, like, the future arc? Like, uh... It was just kind of like, up, here they are, we introduce you. Up, oh, they're dead. <laughs> like, you know, it's like, I don't know. It's like, I'm not totally sure. I may switch to Redemption Raw but next week, <laughs> honestly. <laughs> but we'll, we'll see, we'll see. We can keep playing if, uh, if, if you guys want to. But let's see, maybe it gets better. That's what I was thinking. I was like, I kind of want to maybe try the next chapter to see if it, uh, if it gets better next chapter. It's not character driven, it's plot driven. I think that's the main difference. I feel like I do just prefer stuff uh, that's more character driven, you know what I mean? I always feel like characters are like, what makes a game, you know what I mean? But yeah, it kind of reminds me of the Future Foundation killing game so far, because it's like, I don't remember a lot of those people's names either, and they would die and it would be like, oh no, not him, <laughs> he seemed kind of nice. <laughs> yeah, we can keep going, I guess, and see if, uh, See if we, if it gets better in the next chapter. Well, let's go open the door. After Mary called out, a door opened. We all approached the very suspicious door that led outside. In this place, it's not outside. I can't believe, uh, I can't believe they would lie. I thought the door was going to lead us the way out. Guys, look, there's someone sleeping in the bed. It's like a dead body or something. There is. They're under the covers. Hey, cop guy, is this a job for the police? Maybe I should give her the Kazuna voice. That'll that'll make me happy. Because I feel like, I don't know, I keep giving her and like the girl with the eyeballs like the same voice. I'll give the green haired girl the Kazuna voice. She seems more Kazuna. Uh-huh, I'm not the one thinking it, yo. <laughs> yo, my name is Skylar White, yo. I'm fine, I'll pull the covers off. Is it going to be that guy's body that we just executed? That'd be kind of fucked up. Then Takio reached forward and ripped the sheets off. Oh. <laughs> what is that? A mannequin. What the? How creepy. He kind of reminds me of something. What was that one? Like, like that one horror game? Ah, Baldi. That's, he reminds me of Baldi, I think. That's what it is. It's dressed up like a hospital patient, I guess, to reflect that other guy. We never found out. Oh, Yuya. Okay. I was like, we never found out anything more about Yuya, the kid who got like bullied to death. It says Yuya. Interesting. It's that name again. Didn't we see that same name in that yearbook? The fact it has resurfaced again must mean it's related to this wolf game in some way. There's also a doll over there. Oh, hey, it's that guy. A doll over there as well. Oh, it looks like Satoru from before he was executed. Oh, wait. Okay, okay. I'm starting to get it. I'm starting to get it now, I think. So it seems like Yuya was, like, his patient. So are we, like, all people that, like, failed Yuya? Is that why we were put into the, the killing game? Should I change the music again to, like, Danganronpa investigation music or something? Maybe, like, um... Let's see. Maybe... I'll just go back to the OST. So we're still on the trial music. This is, like weirding me out right now. It's like doo -doo 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 -doo. <laughs> just like talking. <laughs> okay, maybe Beautiful Dead. I think that one's a pretty good chill. Chill, dang it, grandpa. Dang it, grandpa chat. Oh god, not the year turn to die dolls. It certainly does. It looks like it's holding something in its hand. 
What? Oh, when will you learn? No matter, you'll be thrown away. Do you guys know that video with that kid when he's like, when will you learn the consequences of your actions? I fucking love that kid. The video is so funny. Whenever I see that line, I always think of it. What does that mean? I have no idea. Oh, this patient chart. Side effects of medication are listed here. But this is from five years ago. Should try looking through this. After a thorough physical examination of the patient, I endeavor to prescribe the correct dosage. The patient had a, had most definitely been prescribed a dangerous dose. Special care to keep a watch on Satori from now on. And Satori's name is written here. And moreover, why was he holding it in his hands? Um, that dangerous dosage, it said. This probably means that Satori prescribed unsafe dosages to his patients. Ew, that's why, uh, that's why, um, Osami oh, Classics, Sonic fan. Oh, he was playing up a character. I just fucking love that video. It's so, so fucking funny. Because I think he was talking about, like, Sonic or something. When will you learn your actions have consequences? <laughs> I fucking love that kid. He's so funny. But, um, oh, yeah. So that makes sense. His execution. It's really starting to make me think that Yuya is the mastermind. He's like trying to get revenge on all of us. Because it's like, uh, it seems like this guy was over prescribing medicine to patients. He probably did that to Yuya, too. You know what I mean? But I thought Satori was a good doctor. And for what purpose is there a doll of him here? There must be something we can use to figure out who was running the wolf game. Oh, there was also another thing written on the wall. All of you being, <laughs> I'm just gonna imagine Yuya, the guy who, uh, the guy who set up this killer game is just the, that kid, the Sonic, the Sammy Sonic kid. When will you learn? You have to learn now. I'm putting you in a killing game. <laughs> that's where, that's when you'll fucking learn the consequences of your actions. Thank you, David. Oh my God, there's a wolf? Where? No, the regular kind. <laughs> Thank you for the donation, David. The game's been, uh, very interesting so far. Very, very, very quickly paced so far as well. Oh yeah, I guess I'll just do... Let me change this to like... The title to chapters one and two. Because I think I want to try to get through this chapter too. And two. Deaths and executions. Because... I know you guys are bloodthirsty. That's what's gonna get everybody to click on the video. <laughs> Just putting deaths and executions. All of you being here is not a coincidence. It was inevitable. Oh, that totally is it. Fucking you, yeah, dude. All of us being here was inevitable. That's saying we all have something that links us together. But isn't this the first time we've all... First time we've all met each other? So, okay, that makes sense then. So we've all... We've all fucked over you, yeah, somehow in our life. I've been a shut-in all my life. And I know I've never met any of you before. Then what is the purpose of this room? I thought they said they'd open a door out of here. Yeah, what the heck is the meaning of all this? We cannot leave. You let you leave the first time. What? That's dirty. You said we can leave if we executed the wolf. We were fucking lying. It's not dirty. We said we would open the escape door, but we never said it had to be the first one. Just said we'd open a door. We didn't say where we'd go to. Obviously, it's gonna go to the next room. Don't try to twist the words. Yeah, you never said anything about not letting us out of here on the first time. Appearances can be deceiving. We didn't lie. We just gotta stretch the truth a little, a little bit. What? You can't be serious. I'm sorry. Sorry doesn't fucking fix it. Well then, let us decide the next wolf. The wolf game is continuing? Of course, you cannot leave until it's all over. So in, so in other words, nobody can leave until the game is over. That's not quite it. You can definitely escape outside. Yeah, that was another thing I learned from the other video. It's like, the doors keep opening, but whether or not it leads outside, we don't fucking know. Well, only for those who solve the truth behind this game. Truth, what do you mean? I feel like that would drive me mad, being like, you just never know when the door is actually going to open up to, like, the end of the game, you know what I mean? Oh, well, um... I'm sorry, I said too much! Oh, she slipped. Oh, she spilled. Latourian decide who the next wolf is, come on. Hey, what do you mean the truth of this game? That all... That 
all of you should already know how you tortured that poor little boy. Allegedly. We know. What does that mean? Be careful of one another beyond that. There isn't much meaning. I'm trying to think, too, how everybody's connected. I think, um... So that one guy, I think his name's Takia, the guy we just saw. I could probably go back to his picture or whatever. God dang it. Maybe I can't. Maybe I'm... It skipped, like, right over his picture. This guy. He's, like, a celebrity or something. Maybe he got canceled. That's why. That's why Yuya put him in the killing game. How could you, Takia? You were my fave. Until you said those off-color jokes on TikTok. And be careful of one another. Beyond that, there isn't much meaning. I'm handing out the cards now. Oh, thank you, Biyuki. Hopefully this chapter focuses more on the characters. The pacing of the first one was really fast, I know, yeah. It was super duper uh, fast. Hope, and that's what I'm hoping for, too. It does seem more plot-driven, which, yeah, overall I do prefer more character-driven... More character-driven content in general, because I feel like... I don't know, I feel like you can't have, like, a good story if, like, the characters aren't good, you know? Because then it's like, why am I rooting for them, you know what I mean? But we'll, we'll see. Choose the next wolf. Okay, let's go for it. Yay, I wonder what I'm gonna be. I hope I'm a wolf, that'd be pretty epic. Ah, uh, damn it, a sheep yet again. Thank you for the dono, appreciate ya. I'm glad I didn't get a wolf. And who the heck is Yuya? We still don't have much information to lean on. Just like last time, the wolf must kill a sheep. Chop, chop, I know you, hopefully you'll make short work, hopefully you won't make short work of it actually like last time. And just like that, the wolf doll vanished yet again. It's like, man, I like slaying, but that was a little too quick. We have to kill someone yet again? That seems to be the case. But we don't, but we know each other. No way. Do we? Do we know each other? We're best fucking friends now, Weeby. Get over it. Well, if you don't want to die, then I suggest you follow the rules. What? How can you say something so bluntly? Really, I'm not the one with a scary looking face. How dare you? You seriously do not want to piss me off. I weigh like 100 pounds, bro, and I'm like 5 foot 3. That's tall compared to Weeby. Hey, there's no point in fighting now. Humph. I'm already fighting again, you two. How can we avoid it when things are this tense? But I think this is so, so much fun. He's kind of got like makeup on too. Did you guys notice that? He's got like green and like pink blush on, I think. You always make such strange faces. See, well, well, actually, was it just his blushing that was like that? I'll point it out next time. Hey, that's not very nice. He's got the crazy eyes, man. We've already begun to suspect one another. Anyway, at least we should try to avoid having any more arguments from now on. It's watching. Okay. You know, huge, honestly, huge shout out to Blue Horror Gaming for translating this, though, because they really are, like, the only person I know that has translated this game. So, major shout out to them. I definitely highly recommend subscribing to them. I have their, um, have their channel linked in the description. Licked? Did I say licked instead of linked? Linked in the description. <laughs> and so many hours later, somebody's already fucking dead, aren't they? <laughs> okay, nothing happened yet. Okay, good, good. Can I please, can I please bond with these characters? Okay. Rintaro is slaying in the good way so far. I like the I like the green and like pink blush that he's got on. That was that was pretty good. I had come to this room with the intent to sleep, but my nerves were still on edge. If only I could drop my guard just a bit, maybe I could get some sleep, but I don't blame you, dude. Everybody's fucking slaying in this game. Oh hey! Oh god. Huh. It's a flashback. I'm switching schools again, but I don't want to leave my friends. I was like, does she kind of look like the mom from the beginning? I don't know if it's just like, you know, generic faceless woman that's making me think that, but I guess we'll see. You know it's because of dad's work, right? Come on. Fucking hate him. And now I'd like to introduce the new transfer student. It, it, it's nice to meet all of you. Everyone, please welcome him. Class, okay. All right, it's time for everyone to head to science. Which room is science in again? Hey, let me show you around. It's gonna bully me. We can go together. Th th thanks. Huh? Huh? We haven't, like, was that a dream? We haven't learned anything about this guy. So I'm like, 
or girl or them. I, I don't know anything about this person. I'm like, we don't even know their name. We're just called me. So I'm like, well, I guess that was our flashback. Was that, was that a dream? Like, I don't even know if I, like, it's like, my memories get erased? I don't, now I can add lick to the list of words if we've even excused my bad. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. I was like, was that Yuya? I'm like, am I Yuya? Or, I don't know, do we know Yuya? I assume maybe we, I don't know, dude. I always think I'm the mastermind though whenever I play these death games because I feel like that's just such a common kind of like thing in these games that it's like, did you know you were the mastermind the whole time? But I'm like, were my memories erased? Do I not know my name? We never really established that. Those were my memories of elementary school. I have it, I have a, I have that dream a lot. Back then we were always moving from place to place. But enough of that. What time is it now? Because I'm kind of assuming the thing at the beginning wasn't... Well, I would assume that was Yuya who was, like, killing his mom and shit, like, in the beginning. But it seemed like he did, did die. Or, yeah, I was like, we could be Yuya's best friend. That could also... Oh, you know? Oh, what if... What if we were Yuya's best friend, though, too? That could make sense. That could make sense. Because then we, like, betrayed him somehow. But then it's weird that... <laughs> We don't even remember his name. Like, Yuya, our friendship meant so much to him. But we were just like, ah, fuck that guy. <laughs> Who cares? I guess, like, maybe the MC is... Because, like, was the MC supposed to be, like, a self-insert? But then he, they're having, like, flashbacks and stuff, too. So it's hard to know. But enough of that. Um, It's quiet. There's not a single sound. There was no other sound besides those sleeping all around me. I like the song, too. Even a time like this, evil lurked amongst us. I like how she says amongst us, <laughs> or they say amongst us, not to, uh, not to make us uh, say the among us memes. Amongst us, it's classier among us. I suddenly woke up and made my way to the bathroom, the flat room. A strong feeling of evil emanated. Is somebody fucking dead already, dude? Hum, what is that? Oh, from up ahead in the dark hallway, I could see a silhouette. Oh my God, are we about to get slayed? Can it be that's the wolf? What do I do? They're heading this way, but it doesn't look like they've noticed me yet. Yes, wolf slay. What do I do? Do I run away? I don't know. Do I get killed? But if that, but if that is the wolf and I recognize them, then we can execute the right person during the trial. I should follow them. Oh, sussy. They are walking quietly down the hallway as if not to make a sound. Although I don't know for some, for sure, since it's dark, but it looks like they're holding something in their left hand. Kind of interesting. We have to follow them. Uh, then my foot made... <laughs> Fucking dumbass. <laughs> I made the... Then I stepped on some really annoying creaking sound. Upon hearing that sound, they stopped. Fuck. Crap. Oh, hey, we get to hide. You made a sound. Where do you hide? Oh, that's cool. I like some of the choices you get to make in this game. Wasting no time. I duck behind a pillar. I just wish, yeah, the characters got flushed out more. If I'm certain, I'm certain if I breathe, they'll kill me. So I hold my breath. Thank goodness. I don't want to think what I would have done if, if they caught me. I hear the wolf continue down the dark hallway. They're like, yeah, it must have been the wind. That was dangerous. But is it safe to leave now? No, I think I'll, I'll stay for a bit longer. I head towards where they had just gone. In my haste, I turned the corner quickly to catch up to the wolf. Without thinking, I decided to follow them as I turned the corner. Oh, what the fuck? Oh no, he's in a furry suit! Damn it! <laughs> just around the corner, the wolf was standing and waiting for me. God damn it. Oh god, am I about to get... I have to get away! It really does kind of look like one of those like fursuits. With all my force, I booked it down the dark hallway. I like how goofy it is too. It's like... Just in a silly, goofy mood. <laughs> Which room should I even run to? Ah, oh, fuck. If I don't hurry, I'll, I'll be killed. Oh, no. The killer. The wolf saw me and they're a furry. Damn it. <laughs> oh, God. I ran to the kitchen. Huff, huff. And I huffed and I puffed. Where can I hide? Okay. Cupboard. With nowhere else to go, I ducked into the kitchen cupboard. Oh god, they're looking at me. Crap, the wolf came into the kitchen. I'm fucked. Shit, he's coming this way. How do you do, fellow furry? He's looking for me in the cabinets. 
Okay, God. I think they might. I think they might get discovered so close. Their footsteps are getting closer. We get all the way to the last cupboard, and they're like, mm, nah, I don't feel like opening this one. <sighs> Shit, what do I do? If I stay here, I'll die. Oh, God. The sound of the footsteps started heading towards where I was hiding. Crap, I'll be found. Do, 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 do. Okay, wolf is coming. What do you do? Call out or move? I do like this part of the game. It's pretty cool. Ah! <laughs> ah! The wolf's like, what the fuck? I like how goofy he is. When the wolf hears me shout, scared of being discovered by the others, they run away. Really? Well, no, I guess that does make sense, actually. I like how they give them, like, a little wolf. Uh, <laughs> he's like... The wolf comes up and he's like, oh yes, you got voted to be the wolf. Here is your fursuit. Get to slaying. That was a close call. What would I have done had I had it tried to kill me? The only thing keeping me from the wolf then was a thin layer. Several hours later, I waited for the others to wake up, not making a single sound. Then I made my way to the living room. Okay. Living room's kind of creepy. Morning, guys. Morning. Yo! Morning! It doesn't seem like anybody has realized the wolf acted last night. Nobody heard my scream? Well, it hasn't been long yet. Scream! Oh, God. <laughs> Somebody dead already. <laughs> A shrill scream pierced the air. I, I wonder who was killed. Why do, you Why do you sound so excited about that? It sounded like it came from upstairs. We all hurried to the second floor. It's there! How terrible. Somebody, god dang it. Oh no, Takuya, I kind of liked him. We kind of got to know him a little bit. In front of us lay Takuya's sprawled body. Damn you, wolf, damn you. So this time it was Takuya. More importantly, how it was done. Please, don't move the body. It looks like it was done with a blunt object. Oh, a murder has happened, a slay. That means starting now you have 12 hours before the wolf trial begins. Well then everybody, we'll see you then. Why do I have a southern accent now? We really have to do another trial. Man, I was kind of hoping they would flesh out the characters a little bit more, but at least we kind of got to know them like a little bit uh, in the last trial. Takio was like the actor guy. I fear that this was the work of that wolf in the first suit that chased me yesterday, damn you. Damn you, furry nation. Oh no, I liked his hat. They probably would have done the same to me. All because I hid in that cupboard, cupboard like a coward. I feel like I would have been smarter to, like, contact the people, the rest of the group, to say, like, hey, yo, I almost got, uh, almost got killed. So <laughs> maybe, maybe we should, like, look around and see if we can find the wolf in, like, a group of some sort. Like, I don't really know what they expected. Like... I can't believe the wolf killed again after they tried to kill me. Because, like, if he would have gotten, like, a group to look with him, like, you know, go to the bedroom and gotten, like, several people to look for the wolf, then, like, maybe we could have found them, but I don't know. <laughs> Speaking of that, the wolf was wearing a mask. Where have I seen it? Oh, my God. Oh, yeah, the furry convention. Duh, I totally forgot. <laughs> first things first, I need to start investigating the wolf. Okay, I guess we can get some investigation music going on. Mass and piranhas. Interesting title for this. It's like, I guess I could just try to finish this game really quickly if we want to. Because it's like, damn, I feel like I could finish this entire game in one stream. The pacing, but the way it's going at this point. Okay, let's do some investigation. Maybe we'll do Danganronpa 2 investigation music. I could have Danganronpa 1 last time. Oh, I put investion. Slay, Weeby. Good job. <laughs> investigation music. Okay. Oh, I love this song. Dyer has got such a good soundtrack, man. Okay. Speedrun stream. It's like, should I just try to do the whole game? I'm kind of curious about the whole Yuya stuff. I just like, it's hard for me to care about when they die because I feel like I'm just like, oh no, he had a cool hat, you know? It's like, <laughs> I don't know. Oh, hey, he looks like a little doll too. Takuya's body is lying there. His face has been bashed in underneath all that blood. <laughs> Ingestion music. <laughs> Another word to add to the list. Damn it. Damn it. <laughs> uh, we are getting a lot of good memes from this stream, though. For that, I appreciate. 
Oh, hey, there's another little mask. Is that a, is that a sheep mask? Okay, so I guess they just found it then. Oh, that mask. That's definitely it, last night. That's the wolf who chased me, what the wolf was wearing who chased me or whatever the fuck. I wanna look at it, but it's too high up to reach. Okay. Do, do, I fucking love this song so much, dude. I think somebody was saying the pacing for the other, the sequel, I, or maybe not the sequel, but like the AU version of this one is better. Like, uh, I think it's like Wolf Game and I think it's like literally like Wolf Game Another or something. But I don't know if that one's actually translated. <laughs> you should brace the meme and play the Kevin Macload royalty free music. You know, I'm so untrusting of royalty free music because the last royalty free music I used, I got claimed on like all my videos with it on. I was like, what the hell? It looks tall enough for me to reach that mask. Um, what? Didn't you see what I was writing just- You didn't see what I was writing just now, did you? Okay, sussy baka. I was writing, I'm the murderer. <laughs> oh no, I wasn't really looking. Oh, okay, good. I was writing some fanfic of me and the wolf. Don't get the wrong idea of me. There's nothing to worry about. I can fix him. <laughs> I won't. <laughs> I will. Um, what the hell? It looks like Chie has an- Oh yeah, her name was Chie. Looks like Chie has hidden some sort of papers. Inside of that box. It looks like she's keeping things that she doesn't want anyone to see in there. Anyways, I've got another, I've got other things to take care of. Like these masks. Mostly I need to check out that mask that the wolf from last night wore. Okay. Oh, was that a stepladder? Oh my god, stepladder Chan, you're back. Do, 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 do. Come on, slow used in many YouTube channels. It should be fine. I'll uh, check it out though. Let me use a ladder, cause yeah, I've like been so nervous about having an outro song for my videos now. Yeah, this is it. The wolf from yesterday was using this exact mask. Why is it so goofy? Hmm, there's a little bit of blood on the inside here. Oh, does that mean they were wearing this when they killed Takuya? Kind of some me wonder is if Takuya was the wolf, honestly, and like the victim killed him. You know what I mean? Or did they did they say what happens if a sheep kills somebody? Is that like? actually against the rules. I don't know if they really established that. The rules were very vague. So I have no clue who could have planned that as the wolf. Because it just seems so, I don't know, kind of, I don't know, I just feel like that seems like a twist they might do. I should probably look for more clues about who the wolf could be. Uh, but there, but where would be a good place to look? Okay. Takia, how terrible. Looks like that bastard of a wolf did it again. Yeah. Huh? Huh? What is it? He's got something in his right hand. Is that a is that a phone? Yeah, an iPhone this whole time, bro. Can I play Candy Crush on it? Oh it is. I was so focused on his messed up face that I completely missed that. Oh. Um, this phone screen is a bit cracked, so Takuya's face is messed up. I feel like he was the wolf then, honestly. Man, we don't get to see an execution though if he was the wolf. Maybe the culprit damaged it during the attack? Probably, but then isn't this weird then? Oh, what is it? This spot, there isn't any blood. It looks like they wiped the blood away with their fingers. <laughs> you got any games in your phone? Could he have, could he have used the phone after the attack? There's a good chance. I wonder if there is something he left behind on it. Oh, his girlfriend. Yeah, but the phone is blocked. It's a picture of him with a girl. I wonder if that's his girlfriend. Do we get a little bit of a trauma dump? I'm like, please, please. I want some kind of trauma dump. Just anything, anything. I'll take a vague flashback. Just the tiniest little bit of information. Be like, yeah, he loved his mom. I'm like, oh, thank God. I can, I can use that to be sad about his death. Um, well, we won't be able to get in without knowing the password. It's kind of crazy at the phone. I guess he doesn't have service. That's why I couldn't try to, you know, contact the police. Yeah, if only we knew what the password was. I wonder if Takuya wrote down his password anywhere. He was playing Candy Crush before his face got crushed. Oh my god. That is so tragic. That's what you get for playing a boomer game, huh, Takuya? Oh, speaking of that, that's Takuya's, Takuya's bag. I should be fine to look through it a little bit. <laughs> it's like McDonald's Wi-Fi. We're like in 
A Taco Bell, Takio Bell Wi-Fi. Does that make, does that make Takio the mastermind? It's like fast food restaurant Wi-Fi where it's like the wolf's like, yes, there is Wi-Fi, but it never fucking works. And you're just sitting there like trying to get a signal, trying to get something, man. Is this Takuya's diary? Oh, it's a picture of his, oh, a picture of his girlfriend came out. It's the same one from his phone's lock screen. Okay, cool. Oh, yes, we're getting characterization. Yes, slay, 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 wolf game. Okay, cool, we can read his diary. In Dear Diary, today I was put in death game. I was pretty bummed about that. December 24th, three-year anniversary. Okay, cool. Today is our anniversary. Despite how mean he kind of talked, it looks like he really cared about this girl. Well, for now, I don't think I'm gonna- No! I want to read his trauma! Come on! Come on! I know in his diary he's got some trauma in there. He's like, Dear Diary, I want to talk about my deepest, darkest secrets. <laughs> Dear Diary, this reminds me of that therapy session that I had two years ago. <laughs> Let me write it all down in massive detail. Well, for now, I don't think I'm gonna find anything else connected to, to Kuya. Oh yeah, probably is the uh, password for his phone. The uh, anniversary date, right? Yeah, 1224. It's gotta be it. Man, so close, so close. <laughs> so close to getting a characterization. <laughs> Almost. I'm just gonna pretend there was a bunch of really sad, really sad stuff in there. Take his phone. But what's the password? Do, do, do. It's 1224. Yeah, their anniversary. The password's Takio Bell. All right, I logged in. It was Takuya's anniversary with his girlfriend, December 24th, so that made it 1224. Okay, let's look through the phone. Okay, when I unlocked his phone, it reopened up the camera app. Oh, can we look at more cameras, I guess? Does that mean he took a picture? It's like of me getting murdered. <laughs> this is definitely me when I'm getting murdered. Let's try to look through the gallery. I do kind of think he was the wolf though, honestly. This is a picture of the wolf and literally me when I'm the wolf. <laughs> he's doing, oh my God, he's doing the little wolf wolf face too. That It shows that wolf mask. So it was the same guy that attacked me. Oh my God, in the diary he's talking about, he's like, dear diary, this reminds me of that time I went to that furry convention. Uh, it's like, oh, uh, it's gotta be him then. Yes, it's definitely the same guy that killed Takuya. Do, do, do. They're not sin seeing any kind of murder weapon here. It must have been a knife. Although in the picture, it looks like they're taking the weapon with them. That weapon, it's quite large and kind of narrow looking. No, come on, that can't possibly be the murder weapon. But it must be something important for them to take it, right? It looks like there's still evidence left to find. Besides, I think we're investigating, we've investigated the body enough. We should try looking in the other rooms. Okay. Do, 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 do. Selfie before slaying. <laughs> Always gotta do that. Uh, if only the wolf mask did have like a lip bite. That would be, that would be perfect. Last time I saw it, the light was on. Who did this? Okay. Hum, it looks like this fish tank's light has been broken. I see, so then, why is it here? Why would somebody do this? I have no idea, but it must have had something to do with the evidence. If only we could see the inside tank, but it's too dark to see. Then that would mean somebody was has hidden something inside the tank. Okay, so he hid the murder weapon in there maybe or something? Is that what we're getting at? <laughs> Make the mask live by the thumbnail. <laughs> that would be kind of hard to do, but I could try. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, the light. The subs are kind of messing up. I think, I think if I take this, I can use it in the other fish tank. Let's try taking it with us. Okay, so. Oh, uh, was that where the piranhas are? It's, it's a bit about piranhas in the title. How the fuck do they use piranhas in this murder, though? Oh, wait. Is there piranhas in the tank and they, like, threw him in there? And that's how they killed him? Okay, let's try putting that light in this fish tank. All right, the light is on. Oh, what are this fish doing on that rock? Is it like part of his hand or something? I can see on that rock. Let's try reaching it. Oh, fuck. <laughs> let's not try. Let's not try reaching in and getting it. Uh, whoa, dangerous. Are those piranhas? Yes, yeah, so that's what it is. 
not careful. I noticed it before, but there are piranhas in that fish tank. Do you want to tell me sooner? Seriously, you could have told me sooner. Piranhas eat meat, so you shouldn't stick your little fingers in there. But why are they gathered over there? Is there something there? Even if you're being careful with them, you can't see what they're hiding. There's nothing we can do. We gotta find something. Okay, time to cut your finger off, Mas Masaki. Isn't that, isn't that it? <laughs> Masaki, cut your finger off and throw it in there. Come on. It's the only way. I wonder if somebody's gonna be like missing, like a, I don't know, chunk of skin or something. And that's how we find out who the culprit is? Chicken? Yeah, I thought we could use this to lure the piranhas away. Oh, that's smart. Yeah, that's great. Yeah, let me cut it up and put it on a plate for the little- <laughs> do, the fish, do the fish need a plate? Is this a good time to be cooking? I hope she doesn't put too much work into it. I kind of feel like she's sus. All right, done. Well, let's head back onto the fish tank, you hear? I follow quickly behind Masaki to the fish tank like a good little kid. <laughs> For some reason, being around Masaki always makes me feel at ease. God, she's so wonderful. She would never do anything wrong in her entire life. I trust her with my life. Okay. Okie dokie, time for some chicken. All right, here you go. I'm gonna give the fish salmonella. I take the chicken and decided to drop it far away from the rocks. Once I do that, the piranhas move quickly away and start eating the chicken. Okay. Oh yeah, you can see the blood, kind of. All right, the piranhas are no longer blocking the rock. I can see it. Hum. One of the rocks is covering, covered in something red. What is that? It's like hidden in the rocks, too. What could that be? I'm not really sure. Blood? What? No way! That can't be! Yeah, but, but it might be. What a mysterious red stain. Could it be related to the wolf? God damn it. Somebody poured Pepto-Bismol into this fish tank. They can't keep getting away with it. They can't keep getting fucking away with it. Okay. Oh my god, it's already... <laughs> the investigation's already done. Okay, I actually don't really have any uh, big uh, suspects for this one. I feel like Masaki's like kind of sus, but at the same time, she was helping us. I really... I don't know. I really do... Oh, you know what? No, wait. Could that? Mm. Okay, I don't know if, what I think so far, honestly, is that Takuya was the wolf, but a sheep killed him. And I don't know who the sheep was that killed him. Maybe the girl, Masaki, since they did say that, like, oh, if she got, like, um, the wolf card, she wouldn't even kill a wolf because she just, like, you know, is all about peace and love, you know? We'll see. Time's already up, though. 12 hours have passed for the wolf trial. Very fast 12 hours. Almost felt like 12 minutes. And now the trial shall begin. In this game, it really is kind of like that. It's like, every hour is like a minute. <laughs> trial shall begin. I guess, like, I was thinking because it's a mobile game, maybe that's why it's so short. But yeah, like, they just don't have enough space to make, like, a really long game. But I almost prefer if it was, like, a, I don't know, kind of like laps where, like, there's, like, less characters and less chapters. So you can just make those chapters longer. But I don't know. I wonder if you managed to find all the evidence pointing to the wolf. You do only get the chance to nail the correct wolf. And now once more, we'll leave it to you guys to talk it through. And once you've executed the wolf, another door will open and you'll do all this shit again. I like how there's just, like Twitter on the screen too. Maybe this will be the one that leads out. <laughs> Maybe, probably not. And so let the second wolf trial commence. Yeah, I really wish there was a daily life section, too, where you can see the killer's actions before the murder. Because the actions for the first trial felt out of nowhere. Yeah, me too, honestly. Played Mobile Vision Oswalds with much better characterization. You know, honestly, I have a... I did play, like, The Letter once. That was a pretty good visual novel. Now it was mobile, too, so, uh, I don't know, yeah. I don't know if it really would just be because it's, like, a mobile game. It might just really be because they... Wanted to kind of, you know, get quick to the executions and stuff. It's like, in some ways, I do kind of see, like, the appeal of doing that. Because, like, honestly, sometimes when I play, like, fan games, like, people get, like, really impatient with, like, where's the death? Where's the death? Like, when is the murder going to happen? I just want to see you freak out at the murder. But, like, the characterization and, like, the daily part, the daily life part is so important because it's, like... How am I going to care about who died if I don't, like, know the character that well, you know what I mean? But, um, I know, like, people were complaining on, like, one fan game that I played, like, 
they were just like, where is the, uh, you know, where is the death? Why has nobody died yet? And it's like, come on, you know, it just, it takes some time to get there. You gotta, you gotta approach it slowly to where, um, you know, you can actually get invested in the characters. <laughs> Once you're done being traumatized, check out our official Twitter. I know the reason why, but there is much focus on the character. Why there is but much focus on the character, but that's spoilers. Okay. I'm kind of wondering. I was like, I might be able to get through this whole game. I don't want to look at the playlist because I think there was some spoilers. Because 29 videos were at 9 so far, at like 2 hours. I'm like, ah, we can get through the whole thing. <laughs> 10 hour stream. Let's go. Let's go, baby. <laughs> the victim this time around was that actor, Takuya. For some reason, he was attacked and killed. A killing blow left blood all over the room. Even though he was killed so violently, there wasn't a single witness. And we also and we also weren't able to find the murder weapon, too. But he has been beaten to death, right? Oh, that's so nice. They added the uh, like letters to show who's talking. It couldn't have been a weak woman, right? It couldn't have been me, guys. Wouldn't that mean it had to have been a man? That means it was a woman who did this, right? But if we, we follow that logic, would it make more sense to kill a girl then? Um, that certainly does make sense. Is that really enough to decide that it has to be a man? Yeah, I agree. Depending on the tool used, even a little girl could kill someone. The tool, huh? I didn't see something like a hammer in the armory, though. Yeah, I too did a thorough search. There was nothing like that. Yeah, I didn't see anything either. Me. Um, even though everybody is saying there wasn't anything, the truth is last night I saw something. He saw. They still haven't said anything about that. I saw the wolf. Oh, fuck. The freaking out now. Good select. Honestly, I might actually be able to finish this whole game in like six hours. I'm like, should we just go for it? I kind of want to. <laughs> last night I saw the wolf. And seriously, you don't want to tell us that shit before. Yeah, I was following- yeah, I just was like, oh, that's not important, who cares? Yeah, I was following around- I was following after them, right? If they had killed. Um, are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Lying now would put the spotlight on me. A scary! Then- then doesn't that mean you know who the wolf is? No, the wolf was wearing that wolf mask and a hoodie, so I have no idea who it was. It really? How clever! I'm sorry, but there is one more thing I want to show you guys. It's this. Oh, is that a picture of the wolf? It looks like it was right when it happened. I still don't know their names enough to know when it's when the letter, who the letter means for who's talking. Like I have no clue who this dude's name is. <laughs> it starts with a K though. It seems like. Where did you get this picture? Honestly, I found it when looking at Takuya's phone. He took it on there. Must have taken- I don't know why, it's just like so funny, him like bleeding out and he's like, must take a picture. I mean, it was- it was a good idea though, I guess, to show his like culprit. Must have taken it right after- maybe he wasn't the wolf then, maybe I'm- maybe I'm Delulu. Must have taken it right after he'd been attacked, I'm not quite- but not quite dead yet, and took it from behind. Huh? That's incredible evidence. Was the wolf wearing a mask from the living room? Yep. I looked into that too and found blood on the inside. There's no mistaking it, they use that mask. Maybe it's this girl then. How creepy! Because she was kind of acting sus with the writing notes thing or whatever. But there's still something else we haven't talked about that's in this photo. It looks like it's caught them holding the murder weapon, but I can't tell what it is. Oh, but if you were following them, like you said, then wouldn't you have seen what it is? Well, the weapon was. Did we see the weapon? I don't even remember that. It was too dark to see. Oh no, it was too dark to see. The wolf is so on edge from that. They're so worried. Would they be happy? <laughs> oh yeah, he did point. They did point that out, didn't they? Sh sure, you could say that. Oh my poor dude could even post it on social media. <laughs> he was like, damn it, must post this on Twitter before I bleed out. <laughs> sure, sure, you say that. My, my. Is that dangerous in that dangerous moment, wouldn't it have been difficult to get away? Then what did you do then? I ran and hid in the cupboard in the kitchen, and I yelled, which made them run away. 
then wouldn't that mean the chance of still holding the item zero? Oh yeah, her name was Maki. Can remember that, I think. Well, yeah. Yeah, this time the fact they took the murder weapon with them so we wouldn't find it's a bit strange. I can't think of a good reason to take it with them. I also found another item of interest. Oh, what did you find? It was this. Like a rock or something? A piece of something? From from some stones? Why would a rock be in that room? Was the piranha from the piranha tank? Maybe a piece of the murder weapon? Oh huh, man, that color. I've seen something like this before. I got it! This is definitely... Man, we only have like five pieces of evidence. <laughs> I just noticed that too. Oh my god. <laughs> This trial is going to take like two minutes. I feel like it might honestly be shorter than the last one. A fish tank rock. Yeah. Wouldn't the rocks in the fish tank in the greenhouse be big enough? Oh, yeah. Speaking of that, we found the rock that was different. Different how? Yeah, we found one rock in the tank that was stained with a strange color. And before that, we had to distract the piranhas to even see it. What really now? So is that rock in the tank the murder weapon? Most likely it looks like the same stone that was left behind. Wouldn't that be too obvious? Who's O? Who who's O? I don't remember. <laughs> well then you look at well I whatever. Well when you look at it it does look like the same rock. So Takuya was killed with a fish tank that the wolf used. And then they returned the rock to hide that fact. Okay, so the rock, okay. So they weren't, man, I thought they were thrown into the, uh, I thought they were thrown into the fish tank. Uh, that would've been a more epic way to slay, personally. <laughs> personally, if I was to slay, I would've thrown them in the fish tank, but I guess they just used, just boring, used the rock and then threw it back into the tank, whatever. Not, not very slay of you, not, not a very serving uh, slay, I'll say. Seems like it. What? How fucking boring. Even so, it'd be hard for someone like me to even hold that big... <laughs> I'm just too tiny and petite. It'd be way too hard for me to hold that big rock. It's like this big. <laughs> I just do a heavy. I can't do it. <laughs> Wouldn't that be a good point that the wolf would have had to have been a bigger person? Okay, it's fucking this girl, dude. She keeps... She's pulling a fucking Mitch, dude. She's like, it has to be a man. It can't be a woman. There's no fucking way. She's doing the reverse Mitch, honestly. <laughs> the reverse Mitch. She's like, it has to be a man. No possible way. That, it's a boulder. It's not a boulder. It's a rock. <laughs> I forgot about that episode. Well, that's so funny. Yeah, it'd be really hard for a girl to not only carry that heavy rock, but use it. I'm really starting to think it's her, though. She's being so sus. That's a good point. Then, we have to conclude that if the fish tank rock was the murder weapon, then only a man could- <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I feel like she's just- she's pushing it way too hard. It did not look like that big of a rock. Yeah, there's no art- <laughs> Maybe I am wrong, but these were the same people who were like, He must have been stabbed after we already confirmed there was no stab wound. <laughs> But if that's what it is, then we still have no idea who could have taken it. It's like a five pound rock. Yeah, she's like, it's too heavy. Yeah, this time we don't have much information about who the killer could be. If all we can confirm is that it's a man, then wouldn't that mean who he executes a random choice? Hey, hey, what's with the crazy eyes? Eep, I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> you Kazuna. Ka <laughs> she's kind of like a Kazuna Kana. Mixture is what her design kind of reminds me of. She's like kind of but sassy. Oh man, but he was only attacked quite violently, right? Maybe we missed something in that room because there was just so much blood everywhere. Yeah, he's right. There was a lot of blood, and about that. Dee -dee 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 Oh, thank you, Phoenix Productions. Crazy to me that this isn't even the first time fish tank rocks are a murder weapon in a Danganronpa like game. I know, right? For real. <laughs> and yeah, 12 hours for five pieces of evidence. They were just, you know, they were just being real slow. Real slow. Time and Wolf game works differently. 
An hour is a minute, so technically they only even they only had 12 minutes. We'll just go with that. <laughs> Thank you for the dono, by the way, Phoenix Productions. The wolf should have been covered in blood too. Oh no! How can he use logic on me? He's killing me with facts and logic. No. Yeah, okay. In the room, Takuya's blood was everywhere. Then wouldn't that mean also that the wolf should have been covered in blood too? But he had the fursuit on. That's right! What would they have done if they were covered in blood? I miss Monocro too. Well, it'd be a good idea to wash it off. If it got on their clothes, wouldn't it have been hard to get it off? If we follow Rintaro's reasoning, then the wolf had to have blood on them. Hmm, but we'd have to pick up from one of the guys. I have a bad feeling about this. We're gonna get it wrong. I kind of hope we get it wrong. Do -do -do. Who is the most suspicious? Oh no, Takeo! Is he? Is he the most suspicious? I guess, is it just because he's like swole? Is that it? I guess so. <laughs> Takeo! I'm a cop! What? You've changed your shirt. But what for, Takeo? Oh, is that it? I didn't even notice that. That's... Oh, he is wearing a different shirt. I didn't even notice. Most certainly, he was wearing a white shirt yesterday. <laughs> Nobody ever changes their clothes. How dare you, Takeo? How fucking dare you? I was just noticing this too. The, um... The green-haired girl? Crap, I forgot her name. She, like, honestly, even her little hat kind of looks like the wolf, uh, like, mask a little bit. But, I don't know, just, just a thought. I didn't even notice. Most certainly he was wearing a white shirt yesterday. Nobody ever changes their clothes. That's, I wore it to bed, and I got hot, so I sweated in it. I know that's a bad reason, but, but let me explain. Disgusting. Hum. Then where is that shirt? Oh yeah, it's it's drying in the shower room. Can we go to visit that maybe? I can't go get it. I, I can't go get it, but it's definitely there. You gotta believe me. Huh? But there wasn't any shirt in the shower room. Oh! What 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 do you mean? I'm sorry. Before we started, I went to the shower room. Ah oh, shit! I'm not lying. I definitely left my shirt in there to dry. I I'm sorry, but I'm not. I'm not lying either. Is it really him? It's like the wolf didn't look like you know to have as big of like a stature you know as him. So it was like I didn't think it would be him, but I don't know if they just drew it to look more like a generic frame so we wouldn't know who the wolf was. No way. So see there, he's got the little blush right there. He's got like the little green, a little pink. You know, if there's anything I can say about this game, it's that Rintaro. He does slay. In the good way and most likely in the bad way too. Actually that shirt's a little horrifying though. What the fuck is this? It's like tongues like drooling. Ew. Okay, never mind. He's slaying in the bad way. <laughs> slaying in the bad way as in the shirt is a fashion disaster. The jacket's cool though. I do like that. That white shirt you were wearing. Wouldn't that make you the only one here that meets all the conditions? Look, even if it's not in the shower room, it has to be somewhere. You gotta believe me. And look, we can't know that for sure, old man. And let's just go for it. We see through your lies. Why do I still kind of think it's her? I'm not gonna be, I'm not gonna be like, honestly, I'm not gonna be like, Takio is the only man out of the group. Only he could pick up a rock. <laughs> that is so true, bestie. That is so true. <laughs> Oh man, guys, we gotta all try to pick up a rock to deduce who it could have been. We may as well just execute him then. I kind of feel like we got the wrong person, but we'll see. No, you can't do that! I feel like our logic's kind of shit, <laughs> but I can't tell. We only have like five pieces of evidence either, so I'm like... Uh, it just, I don't know. I feel like that green hair girl keeps pushing so hard and... I feel like our evidence is just that he changed shirts and that he's like buff like I don't know man <laughs> I can't I can't really I, I feel like we're getting it wrong but I don't know if I'm just being delulu S speaking of that last night I also I also found this this is it's something burnt white fabric oh it's a shirt got burnt this this has to be Takio's white shirt right 
What the? That's, that's impossible. Where did you pick this up? Last night, I went to the kitchen because I smelled something burning. Could it be this guy? I wanted to investigate the source of the smoke. And that was when I found this burnt piece on the ground. <laughs> and Detective Ritzy was on the case. <laughs> Let's slay, guys. Come on, hurry it up before you start talking some more. You were trying to burn the damning evidence of that shirt, <laughs> weren't you? No! The wolf is setting me up! They took my shirt to pin this on me! I kind of think they... I kind of think he is getting pinned, honestly. That's a bold thing to assert! No, it really wasn't me! Damn, I got it! I'll come clean, the truth is... Last night, my shirt was stolen! Uh, what? Huh? You really are gonna go with that? For real? What a lie. Oh, hell yeah! It's this song! Oh, hell yeah. Oh my god, I fucking love this song. <laughs> just jamming out. I'm just vibing the music this whole stream. That isn't what you said before! Lying was... Uh, lying was I! I'm sorry. When I said I took it off because I was hot, it was a lie. Then, then why? Why would you lie about that? Why would you be so suspicious for no reason? Why would you fucking lie about that shit? That's so weird. How are we supposed to believe you now? I love this song. Well, the truth is... Hey, what could you even say? Do we have enough to ex- This fucking girl- She did it, dude. Do we even have to execute him? Please, give me a chance. The truth is, last night I got a letter. Oh. Eyeball girl was writing a letter. A letter? What did it say? The contents. Well, let me tell you. Oh. <laughs> From a lovely lady. Yes, yeah, the scrum debate music. I saw somebody uh, ask. If you look up like V3 scrum debate music, it should come up. It was from an invitation. It was an invitation from a woman. <laughs> huh? That's so shameful. I mean, it seems like it might have been the eyeball, 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 eyeball girl who wrote it since she was writing something. You really think you can try to pull something like that? Who would be attracted to you? Hey, come on, it's embarrassing, but... <laughs> Fucking lipstick mark, dude. Oh, God. <laughs> and look, looks like you're just a perverted old man after all. Hey, ugh, yuck. Ugh. Anyway, the letter said, come... <laughs> <laughs> my man. <laughs> oh, my God. He really, he really thought he was about to get laid. <laughs> <laughs> what a doofus! <laughs> oh god! Then he gets murder pinned on him. Come take a shower with me, lipstick mark. <laughs> and so I would. <laughs> I think like he doesn't even know who it's from. And he just is like, hell yeah, baby, <laughs> let's go to the shower. <laughs> Papa's about to get some tonight. <laughs> I can see why he was lying about it. <laughs> That's pretty embarrassing. It's pretty embarrassing. And so I went, I waited while I took a shower. Oh my god, I'm fucking dead. Oh, while I was in the middle of showering, I could tell that someone had come in. <laughs> so I left the shower, my clothes were taken along with the letter. Oh, what a dumbass. And then I had no clothes. It was so embarrassing, that's why I lied. I had all my clothes stolen. And the person who took them was the killer. Huh? Do you really expect us to believe that? <laughs> you can't be that stupid, right? No, I truly am that stupid. And there's no proof that this letter existed. It's true, believe me! Come on. Um, but it sounds like you made it up on the spot. I think this girl's sus, too. I kind of, like, feel like they work together almost, but I don't really know why they would. Yeah, it sounds like a big, fat fib. Without any proof, it's really difficult to believe your story. 
God, I just really wanted to get some, guys. I'm just really down bad. You guys, you just don't understand, man. I'm not good at lying. Really, believe me. <laughs> I can't. I've been set up by the wolf. Um, even though you say that, well, 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 considering the conditions, you are the perfect wolf. Rintaro is even pushing it hard, too. There isn't any other good theory, right? Not any of us can lift a rock. Only you could. There isn't any good theories, right? No way, but it's, it's fucking wrong. I swear to God, I'm not the wolf. I was just down bad. You gotta believe me. Is that a crime? Is Takia really the wolf? If I compare him to the wolf I saw last night, well, he gives off completely different vibes. Oh my gosh. Maybe if I can cool it, I can think of something. What is this weird thing in the hand? The, 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 the rock is like two pounds. Oh my god. <laughs> no, no, it's a really dense rock, Weeby. That rock is like a hundred pounds. It's just really dense. It's made out of like... What's like a... I feel like there's like some rock in like a Marvel movie or something that's like... It's so fucking dense that even like this much of it's like 200 pounds. <laughs> Only he could have picked that thing up. <laughs> the rock is so tiny. I just thought maybe, like, okay, maybe it just, like, looks a little... It just looks small in regards to the fish tank. <laughs> the rock is so small. <laughs> I'm dead. Last night, when I was looking up after the wolf, they were carrying something in their left hand. <laughs> but isn't Takio right-handed? <laughs> I just love how we're refuting this, but not the fucking rock argument. <laughs> they were just like, no, nobody can carry that rock. <laughs> oh my god, I'm dying. But is it Takio right-handed? Okay, I gotta say, Takio's best boy. I've decided. He's got enough characterization. I love him. I stand Takio. He did nothing wrong. Um, is this okay? <laughs> and what? Last night when I was following the wolf, I'm confident they were holding something in their left hand. But Takio is right-handed. Yeah, I am. I'm not the wolf, man. I'm just down bad. Really? But weren't you following them in the dark? Do you have any proof? Well, for proof, it's just in my memories. But she may or may not have my memories from my past. We don't really, we don't really know yet. Even in the picture from the phone, too, you can't tell which hand they're holding it in. Takio, best boy. <laughs> well, what'd you want if it's your memories? How can we trust that? I, too, find it hard to believe. Uh... Hey, <laughs> fucking try harder! Tell them! I was gonna say tell them Nagi or like a distinction of that, but you don't have a name, so tell them probably Yuya. <laughs> If you don't want, if you don't, then I'm gonna die. Hurry and convince them. I guess there's not really that big of a punishment for them getting it wrong too, so that might be why they're just kind of like, ah, fuck it, let's just convict whoever. <laughs> like, yeah, it's probably Takio. Yeah, that guy's kind of creeping me out, anyways. It's like I, I don't really like cops, so maybe we should just vote him out, anyways. <laughs> okay, I am confident in what I saw, but I can't remember anything else. Well, if we don't have any more evidence to go over, let's just fucking convince him. Convict him right now. Then we should be fine with executing Takio. I just kind of want to slay. Who cares if he did it? Yeah, it's hard to think it could be anybody but Takio. Yeah. Man, it's <laughs> fucking dumbasses, dude. You gonna say anything, bro? You gonna say anything, bro? <laughs> yeah, perhaps. Oh, god damn it. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> uh, as a left-handed person, I can assure you my right hand is unusable. As a woman, <laughs> I'm fucking dead. As a woman, I can assure you, I can't lift a rock. That is so true, guys. Pure 100 <laughs> percent confirmation. That's basically what Ritsu's doing right now. She's like, as a woman, I can assure you that I have never lifted a rock in my life. I don't even know what a rock is. Perhaps I was mistaken. No, what? No, Takio! No! No, he's the best boy, guys! Fuck this game. You see this octopus? 
He's mad. He's angry right now. Unless unless we save Takio, then we will begin the execution at once. No! Like, Bro, give him a fucking chance to trauma dump on me. All I know is that he was down bad. No, not Takio. He was the best boy. He's the fucking not Takio Bell. I hate it here, man. I fucking hate it here. Let me get the audio ready for you guys. No! Oh, god damn it. They really are gonna execute him right here and right now. God damn it. Takio! Okay, oh, wait. everybody. Okay, this. I guess they're gonna talk first. Okay, everybody, for this execution, you have chosen Takio. <laughs> yes, Slay! Harry and execute him! It's really not me! Fucking believe me, guys! Y'all are all so fucking stupid! This is what everyone has decided. No way, is there nothing, nothing I can do? No, you agree, don't you? Yesterday you saw the, yesterday you saw the wolf, right? I'm not the wolf, right? I don't know, what did I see again? I can't remember. I kind of, for, I forgore, honestly. <laughs> uh, I can, you know, there's a lot of stuff I saw last night. I saw a wolf mask, I saw a dark, it just, mm, I don't know. Let us begin the execution. Okay, it's gonna start now. So I kind of remembered it. No one to turn on the volume. This execution, we have something special planned for this cop. No, don't do it. Not Takio Bell. Oh my god, is he gonna get executed at a Taco Bell? That'd be kind of epic, honestly. He definitely is not the wolf. No. 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 The best boy. The fucking best boy. This is so sad. Oh, it's a little wolf slide. Oh, like conveyor belt, actually. Oh. Oh my god, it's coming after him! This isn't police themed! See, he I'll was not the wolf! Save yourself. I'll tell you how to save yourself. Oh. Catch sheep, and that's it. Okay. Don't let any of the sheeps get away. So I was like, this isn't cop themed. <laughs> oh, okay, now it is. Because they're in like little prisoner outfits. Oh, oh, they're attaching themselves to him. No, talk it out. Not the best boy! Remaining. Oh. Remaining. Oh, he has to keep catching them, and I guess they keep attaching themselves to him. Then he's gonna get munched on. Ah, uh, yeah, they're gonna drag him down. No. Ah, uh, one last sheep. Oh, he did it, but it's too late. No, Tokyo. Ah. Uh. Oh, <laughs> there is one left still. No. <laughs> Tokyo! <laughs> Miss me, bitch! Ah, no, not the best boy! No! Guys, 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 there's pillows. There's pillows in there. He just got stomped by the pillows. Nothing bad happened. Nothing, no, he's good. He's good. He's, he's, he's in Mexico. I give, I give Takio, Ta Taki, Taki? <laughs> Taki Taki? What, what was I trying to say? I give Takio full rights to go to Mexico with the Danganronpa and other cast. He gets that privilege. The doctor guy, he doesn't get that privilege. <laughs> the executions are really good. I've been enjoying those a lot. They kill off their most developed character. I know! He was the best boy, dude. Fucked up, man. Now I don't have anybody that I like anymore. <laughs> he was the only one. Everybody wants to be my enemy. Okay. Bro went to Ohio. No, he went to Mexico. I believe in him. He's with the Danganronpa and other kids. I believe. I believe in him. The power, the power of Delulu compels me. Okay, let's get back to some Danganronpa, like, chiller music, I guess. Um, yeah, maybe I'll do... Eh, no, I'll go back to Danganronpa 1. I feel like that one kind of fits this game a little bit more. Let's go back to, like, Beautiful Dead or something. That one's pretty good. Okay. This is so sad. He was literally the best boy. He literally did nothing wrong his whole entire life. Oh wait, is the title a spoiler? <laughs> god damn it! <laughs> wait. Oh god damn it. <laughs> oh, that's the only bad thing about this playlist is it literally has spoilers in like some of the thumbnails and the titles. God damn it. Oh, it's too late, I guess. Damn it. That's sad. Thank you, Jeff, for the donation, by the way. I can't remember if I thanked you. Thank you, Kyokuro. Hi, I ordered Crunchy Taco Supreme an hour ago. 
<laughs> ah, it's too late. Ah, it's too late. It could be I am the killer, but it might not be me. It might be somebody else. You know what I mean? It could be like Ritsu says that maybe, right? <laughs> right, guys? Right? Okay, whatever. Let's just keep fucking going. It's over. The execution's over. How terrible. But if we didn't kill someone, we'd all be dead. Hey, but... Oh, but if we didn't kill somebody, we'd all be dead. Even though he was a police officer, he still did that. Uh, my life was more important. Fuck that guy. Akab. Oh, God. Because of our decision, we executed the best boy. We're so fucked up. But was Takio really the wolf? Hell no. <laughs> At the end, I couldn't shake that feeling. Were we... Wrong? Well then everybody, thank you for waiting after giving me your answers. The time? This time the executed Takio was... Innocent, you fucking dumbasses! That's what I'm expecting. Wolf or sheep? Second trial, we already fucking got it wrong. I gotta stop cursing. YouTube gets mad about that. Oh, it was a sheep. There we go. So that's what it does. It highlights the sheep when it's uh, wrong. A sheep. Oh, that's too bad. That's pretty sad. We were wrong. I can't believe this. But our logic was perfect. And what? Seriously? Then we killed Takio without a real reason? Yeah, I mean, I felt for sure it wasn't him then. Our reasoning was horrible. <laughs> so bad. <laughs> Correct. Oh, this is so shocking. I was sure Takio was a bad- No, you fucking were it. I feel like Rintaro is just bullshitting us. He's like, no way. He just wants- He's just here for the, tra the drama, the tea of it all. He's like, yeah, I think Ritsu's right. A woman could never pick up a rock. He just- He just wants the drama. But there wasn't anybody else who we could have suspected in that trial. They're like, wait, can women pick up rocks? No, no, impossible. It can't be so. These motherfuckers, though. Ugh. Can you guys see the... <laughs> can you see the little guy in my head? Okay, cool. I'll try to keep him balanced there. I'm upset. This trial made me mad. Just uh, just so you guys know at all times that I'm, I'm very angry that Takio got executed. But there wasn't anybody else we could have suspected in that trial. Yeah, the what? Yes, yeah, so we considered every possible person. Would be kind of cool if we just added another wolf rather than, uh, you know, have to just keep killing or whatever. Looks like... Looks like that bad feeling was right after all. <laughs> Our decision was calculated, but we suck at math. So fucking true. So fucking true. Thank you, Brian. I like how you can get the answer wrong and keep going. It could lead to a lot of character development. If the story wasn't so fast. Yeah, I know. It's like I like the premise and the setup of it. But yeah, it just it goes by way too fast. But yeah, uh, like hopefully, hopefully it'll get better at this chapter. <laughs> This chapter, we'll get to know people. We got to know Takio, kind of, before he died. It wasn't really a trauma dump, but, you know. We still we still love him. Thank you, Wolf Allen. They would not survive a minute in Duncan Rampa. I know. <laughs> I know, dude. I cannot, I cannot believe that rock argument. I thought the argument for the last trial was bad, but they blew me away with that rock. <laughs> the rock argument. <laughs> that was the worst. In the trial. In the trial. Why? Why didn't I fight it? I gave up on my line of reasoning and followed the wrong one. Is it really that I'm the wolf, though? I saw myself? Or is it just... I don't know. Sorry, but since you didn't execute the wolf, we won't be opening a door out. Sucks to be you, losers. No way. Those are the rules. If you execute a sheep, you can't open the door. It sucks to suck. So in order for that wolf to get out alive, they have to convince us to kill a sheep. Oh, so, oh, that was me saying it. So in order for that wolf to get out alive, they had to convince us to kill a sheep. I guess that is the natural conclusion. I, it was slow to come out, but that burnt shirt piece, I think that was the way the wolf deceived us. And because we're all, <laughs> we all share a single brain cell. And we gave we gave it to Takio right before he got executed and he just took it with us and now we don't have any we don't have any brain cells left. I'm like maybe he is we are the wolf. That's why we decided not to like prove it, but 
But why didn't I say anything to save Takio? Why am I so fucking weird and so fucking sus? Well, if those are the rules and there's nothing we can do. <laughs> okay, rest in peace, I guess, you know. Rest in peace to a great one. <laughs> Doesn't even give a shit. At least in Dying Around, but they like kind of pretend to care a little bit. They're like, yeah, whatever. Fuck that guy anyways, that cab. I'm s okay, at least Rintaro. I'm sorry, Takio. Just gonna make him sound sarcastic. I've lost my humanity. That other guy didn't care though at all. Everybody needs to calm down. Fuck that guy. We just need to get the next wolf. <laughs> get to the next. Let's just get the next wolf or whatever. Come on. <laughs> we just need to get the next wolf to get the door open. Such sorrowful hearts. How sweet. Besides that one guy. I forgot his name. Well, it is now time to decide the next wolf. Everybody can pick a card. So are they just like not the wolf anymore then? So wait. So is that what it is? Like, once you get away with being the wolf, it's just like, okay, whatever. Like, dude, that guy didn't even say Sawi or Saws. He was literally just like, yeah, whatever, fuck that guy. <laughs> I hate the police. <laughs> whatever. It was innocent, but he probably did some dirty shit in his life. He was a cop. Come on now. Okay, okay, let's pick this one. Hell yeah, baby, let's fucking go! Even though the title spoiled it, let's fucking go! Slay, 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 slay! Let's kill Ritsu. <laughs> what? Uh, feels like getting the sacrifice card. The the wolf? I've, I've pulled the wolf card. Yeah, I guess we don't, so wait, they're not even gonna know who the wolf was? That's what I'm thinking too, I'm like... I'm like, I guess we just don't, like you know, know who the wolf was. They just get to be a sheep again. They just, it resets every round. I guess that makes sense. But yeah, uh, it kind of stinks we'd ever get to know who it was. In order to stay alive, I have to kill one of the sheep. Suddenly my heart thundered in my ears. I can, I can feel my face go white with fear and horror. Uh, I'm so glad we get to slay. Could I kill somebody? Yes. Slay, slay probably, Yuya. Right then, amidst all my confusion and horror, a certain memory came to me. Oh god. Why? At a time like this? Hey, you transferred so many times. How cool. Old me. And not really, it sucks having to make new friends each time. Everybody fucking hates me. Well, well, I guess I'll be your first friend this time. Oh, okay, thanks. It's my welcome gift. Until you came, I hadn't had any friends before. Oh, really? Is that old me? Is that what the name says for the other one? I guess so. Yeah, truth is, I get bullied for it. Oh, but don't worry one bit. Even if you're bullied for hanging out with me, I won't turn my back on you. I'll just put you in a death game if you're mean to me once. <laughs> it kind of kind of reminds me of like 13 Reasons Why, honestly, this death game. It's like anybody who like slided you, yeah, he's like, mm, <laughs> you're going in the death game. Sorry about it. I believe you wouldn't. Hey, really? Yeah. No matter what, we'll always be fucking besties. Thanks. I'm lucky my first friend is a guy like you. Why at a strange time like this, that old memory come back. Anyways, I need to collect my thoughts to keep myself alive. Even though I pulled the wolf card, I can't lose my way now. <laughs> I don't know why I want to give him like an emo voice now. I have to be prepared. First of all, I'm gonna need some sort of- I love- it. He just accepted this so quick. He's like, okay, whatever, slay, I guess. <laughs> Once I've acquired something, then I'll have to decide who to kill. Will I be able to do it? If I don't, then I'll find myself in a really bad situation. Yeah, I guess he's gotta die anyway, so he's like, eh, whatever. Time to slay. Who are we gonna slay? Maybe this guy? Oh yeah, we're still in the same room too. I was like, oh, we get to see new dolls. I'm like, nope, we're still still in the same room. <laughs> okay. Now that I think about it, Takio's body vanished. Who the hell took it? Yeah, I don't know. What is the goal of this game's mastermind? There are 13 reasons. He is a really distrustful guy. Would it, it would be really hard to kill him. But he didn't care at all about Takia dying, so I'm kind of like, let's slay this guy, come on. <laughs> come on, it'll be fun. Here I am thinking of killing somebody, <laughs> like it's no biggie. Can I really do this? If I want to stay alive, I have no choice. Yeah, I guess next time to avoid spoilers, I'm just going to let the playlist autoplay, because I think I scrolled down to it. I think that was my mistake. 
I didn't realize there was gonna be spoilers in the uh, titles though too. I thought it was just the thumbnail pictures. Huh, the stall is holding a phone. Oh, another phone. Huh, there's a picture post. This account, it must be Takuya's. Based on when it was uploaded, this happened five years ago. Okay. I can't believe I'm the only one posting this. Nobody else saw. Somebody getting like robbed on the train or something. What a freaking rare case. Don't be famous. Like a stalker? Wow, what a heartless and dark thing to <laughs> just like somebody getting mugged. He was like, oh my god. This is so sad that nobody This is so oh god. <laughs> Drop my phone. This is so sad that nobody's doing anything. As he's just like standing there watching with his iPhone. This is so sad. I'm gonna put this post this on Twitter. <laughs> oh dude! Fuda Kenny, that's who he is. He's literally Fuda right there, honestly. <laughs> oh man. God, this guy sucks, unlike me. What a heartless and dark thing to post. Just what happened five years ago. Was he, oh, was he recording, I guess, like Yuya getting beat up or something? I guess that's what it is, and that's why Yuya hates him, probably. Could this be a hint about why this wolf game was started? Oh man, it feels like almost like a boomer meme where they're like, this says a lot about society. <laughs> they have like the photo. They're like not doing anything <laughs> about like a kid getting beat up. There's a doll of Takuya lying here, huh? <laughs> if I die, I wonder what mine will reveal. Rentaro, don't joke about that. Honestly, Nilo, I think I might be going all the way at this point. <laughs> I might just play the whole game. I'm having a good time. It's going by so fast. It's like I kind of want to know like what happens and uh, I think I'd be cool with maybe starting like a fan den or something next <laughs> next week. So we're going all the way, baby. If it takes us six hours. Do, 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 do. I love a song too. Please save us from this fate. Jia seems to always be herself in the storage room. Be, be by yourself in the storage room. And this time too, she hasn't noticed me. It's like she's in a trance. It'd be really easy to attack her here. I better go find- <laughs> This is so fucked up. I better go find a weapon. <laughs> I'm scared of how easy it is for me to think that. Am I- Am I the problem? Am I fucked up? <laughs> is there something wrong with me? Oh my god. It's kind of fun. It's kind of fun being the wolf though, honestly. It looks like another person will be killed. Anyways, as always, it is my duty to record things as they happen. Isami, you really are a researcher. No, this is the least I can do. <laughs> this fucking guy, dude. Could it be that a wolf lies behind those eyes? Behind those hazel eyes. I don't think I'll find any weapons in this room. Fuck, I want to kill that eyeball girl. Maybe somewhere else. This guy's just like... <laughs> All these characters are so fucking chill about slaying. This time it must be fun to be a sheep now. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Bitch, this bitch, I knew it was you. I knew it was you. Oh, fucking god, this shit. Oh my god, it's fine. I'm fine. I'm great. I feel like I'm losing my mind the more I play this game. <laughs> I knew it was her. I fucking knew it was her. And this time it must be fun to be a sheep now because I was like totally the wolf last time. That was kind of slay of me. Oh my god, that was epic. <laughs> you guys totally killed that guy. A bit of a break. Well, there might be a wolf around, so I don't want to relax too much. Is she just, like, talking in the mirror or some shit? I thought she was saying that to me. <laughs> let's fucking kill this bitch. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's fucking go. It, yeah. Hey, well, I gotta... It's, no, she's literally just saying that to me. She just literally walked up to me and was like, Hey, did you know that I killed that guy last time? That was a pretty epic thing. I can't believe y'all believe that shit about the rock. I mean, my lollipop probably weighs more than that stupid rock. How fucking stupid are you guys? <laughs> well, I gotta go grab a drink quick. Don't find the wolf now. Oh my god, come on, come on. Let's, let's kill this girl. The wolf is right before your eyes. Just now I had the opportunity to attack Ritsu. Do it. Kill her with a lollipop. But still, I should find a weapon first. Oh my god, I'll keep looking around. I like this chapter. This chapter is fun. <laughs> oh no, I can't kill my waifu. What's wrong? It's just I know I should be hungry, but I just have this awful feeling. It's just what we have to do to stay alive. There's nothing we can do. Who could eat at a time like this? This guy's so unhinged, she's gonna be like, maybe I should kill her. Is Misaki okay? <laughs> I can't take any weapons with Misaki standing there. I'll look somewhere else. Oh, man. It is fun being a wolf, I gotta say. 
Oh man, sorry, I want to be alone right now. I've seen too many people killed. I need a moment. Well, at least we know it's going to be easy to get away with it with the way these <laughs> with the way these characters are so far. <laughs> Maki really looks worse for wear. Everybody seems so exhausted. I won't be able to find a weapon if she's around. Let's look in another room. Oh god. Oh, thank you, Dara. She's just silly goofy, guys. You can forgive her. <laughs> I was just in a silly goofy mood. It's whatever. I can't believe she did that to Takio, though. Literally the best boy. Oh, cool knives and stuff. It's a tactical knife. There's no one in the room right now. Now will be the time to take a weapon. Yay, slay. After thinking that, I slowly reach my hand towards the knife. <laughs> Ew, there is someone in here. Time. Guys, it's time. It's time to slay. It's fucking time, guys. There is someone here. Huh? What you doing? Are you perhaps here for like a murder weapon or something? Uh, that must mean you're the wolf. Ew, whoa. Slay. 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 Oh my god. It's time. A knifey knifersin. Not fucking knifey knifersin in chat. I'm dead. <laughs> You're wrong! I came to see if the wolf would come here to get a weapon. <laughs> Honestly, that stupid ass excuse might work. I I just wanted to I was role playing as the wolf, you know, to get inside of his head. Okay, I'm gonna change I'm gonna change the octopus to happy again if we kill her though, honestly. <laughs> oh, are you thinking the same thing? Well now, this is the best place to get a weapon. Yeah. No, we're not gonna slay her, damn it. We got the knife. We got her in the room. Come on. Fucking do it. Do it for Takio. Thank you, Biyuki. Slay, slay, slay. I know, right? God, I wish. Fucking wish. I'm gonna do a little bit of I'm gonna do a little bit of digging around here. I'm gonna turn around in the corner where nobody can hear me scream. That was a close call. She could have seen me taking a weapon. To keep Ritzy from suspecting me as the wolf, I should give up on trying to get a weapon from this room. God damn it. <laughs> Is there another room here that's something that has something that I can use as a weapon though? Okay. Oh gosh, we'll just wait for it to automatically go. I'll just try not to look at the title. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Oh man. I hate that the title was such a big spoiler though. Misaki. Oh, oh, she's got a knife? Whoa! You, you startled me! Sorry, I was in the middle of cooking. No, it's my bad for suddenly speaking. No, no, it's okay. What's up? Nothing. I was just curious about what you were up to, bestie. What you doing? I just figured that everybody would be getting hungry soon, so I decided to cook. Okay, sorry for interrupting. She's always cooking. That's alright. It's just at a time like this, I'm a bit on edge. I guess she might always be cooking so she can have like a knife on her at all times, though. Yeah. As long as Misaki is cooking in here, it will be really difficult to take one of those knives. Yeah, so far I gotta say the pacing for this chapter is better. I guess because we're planning on slaying. I have to look at another room for a weapon. Do 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 do. Time to murder. Oh, is he sleeping? I don't want to kill him though. I want to kill the other girl. Ko sleeping. Oh, Ko, that's his name. He's always been the one who's been investigating. Looks like he got tired out. How rare, Ko sleeping. Hey, wanna prank him? I think you should, I think you should cut that out. Oh, Rintaro, my beloved. Oh, died from trying to save others. Oh no, this message. What the hell does it mean? Is that a Takio plush? Oh my God, they get a new little, a new doll of Takio. <laughs> That's sad. Babe, wake up, new, new doll just dropped. Just keep going back to different rooms. I should probably just wait for everybody to fall asleep, honestly. Speaking of which, do you have the time? After saying that, Osamu pulled out a rather old-fashioned watch from his pocket. Wow, that clock- wow, that clock is really stylish. Oh, thank you. Aren't antiques wonderful? I had it spe specially made. I always carry it on me, just like my notebook. 
That's also specially made. Even has a special key. Wow. I said this sarcastically. <laughs> You're really set on that. That style is so cool. What's that thing Regina George said? She's like, wow, that is so cool. Fe what did she, she didn't say fetch, did she? Because she, she didn't like fetch. Whatever. Whatever. Yeah, I like it. I was always looking for more antiques. Really now. Speaking of that, do you like books too? Oh, of course. Besides, reading short novels, I'm also interested in writing as well. Wow, I guess that's cliche for a language teacher. Yes, but why was a language teacher pulled into all of this? I help people grow. It's a really big part of my job. Yeah, I guess. I guess Usamu has more than that side to him. Oh, it was fetch? Okay. Do do do. Wow, I really love your bracelet. That's what it was. The ugliest effing thing I've ever seen. <laughs> By the way, this broken mirror is really dangerous. We're playing as Regina. That's it. That's it. That's what I've been missing the whole time. That's it. This broken shard. I could use it as a weapon, no? It would be as sharp as a knife. These people just waste no fucking time murdering, man. I could end somebody's life with it. But could I even kill someone to begin with? No, but if I don't kill someone, I just have to steal my heart. Back to the point. I have to get a piece of it off. But it would really, but it'd be really dangerous to use my broken hand. Wait, what was it? Bare hand. Is there something I can use to hold it with? Okay. Uh, please, can we slay that girl? Ah. I just wanted, it turned out just a little nap was what I needed. More importantly, the wolf has been on the move. I need to investigate. How do you know the wolf's on the move? The investigator co, even after a nap, he's right back to it. He didn't do a very good job during the trial, though. Steal the steal. I don't know. Uh, I don't know what I'd do if he ever suspected me as the wolf. Wolf, I'd be fucked, man. Nah, he's not that smart. Nobody's smart. He's a, a rohawk and he just like the rest of us. He just kind of looks smart, you know? Wow, it smells so good. Can you wait just a little bit longer? Okay. Misaki is such a good kid. Don't you think so too? Yeah. She certainly is a charming person. But this time, I'm the wolf. If the opportunity happened, I have to be prepared to hurt even Misaki. God dang, this guy's fucking brutal, man. The pressure is driving my heart crazy. Crazy. All right, perfect. I'll set out the plates. I'm happy that everybody will get to eat something. Aren't you gonna eat? I'm still not hungry right now. I'm only hungry for blood. Okay, you'll eat later though tonight, right? The kitchen really does smell super good. Although I'm not hungry at all. This is like the closest thing to a daily life we've gotten so far. That's kind of nice. I wonder if it has to do with being the wolf. Okay, come on. So I don't know when the wolf is going to kill. That's scary. Yeah, on that note, don't let your guard down. And because I might kill you. For all I know, for all I know, you could be the wolf. I can't trust anybody. It's like, why couldn't we have done this when I wasn't the wolf, you know? Just like talk to everybody. But this time I really am the wolf. Oh! Maki, are you all right? You don't look like you're in great shape. Oh, sorry, I'm fine. I hope we don't target her, just a bit tired. She does seem kind of weak, though. Well, when you've calmed down a bit, you should try reading a book. It just, it might just help change you a little, change your, added, your mood a bit. Come on, read some isekai. Fantasy stories, okay, I'll try it. That time I got reincarnated as a princess slime or some shit. <laughs> it's me, bestie, your favorite. Why are you following me around? <laughs> Perhaps you are the wolf and you want it? Yes. That's literally it. That's literally, you got it. You, you got it. <laughs> no, it was a coincidence. And um, you can say that, but you could be hiding some sort of secret special weapon right now. Like a rock. A special weapon? What's she talking about? Does she know? I'm sure she has no clue about the weapon that I have in mind. She sure is a distrustful person. Come on, Slay. Just like... He just hate on cats right now. Did they just hate on cats? Okay. 
Okay, I don't like this protagonist. How dare they compare her to a cat? Cats are precious. Okay, maybe they are assholes, but they're adorable, and that's why I love them. Let's slay. It's time to slay. It's time to slay. There's a bed here. That's cool. Um, it's got a bit of a tear at the bottom. I see. If I use this, can I wrap it around the mirror? Oh, kind of set up like a trap or something. So somebody who's like, whoever lies in the bed uh, gets stabbed by it. I could wrap it around the mirror. I look around me. There's nobody else in this room. It's a big piece of glass chart coming out. <laughs> nobody looks at their bed before they lie on it. I cut off a small piece of the curtain and take it with me. Okay. There is no one in here. Now's the time. Taking the curtain I had before, I take down the mirror piece. Okay. Ow! Oh, a piece slipped as I took it down. Oh, god dang it. They're totally gonna use that as evidence. And I cut my left hand. Oh, hell yeah. Just as I thought, the blood is awful. If anyone saw this, it'd be really suspicious. Got some execution music. Ugh. I guess it doesn't really fit, but... Oh, it's so good, though. I do love the execution music. Thousand knocks, hell yeah. Okay, let's go back to Desire for Execution. Hurriedly wrap the mirror piece with the cloth, a makeshift blade, and place it in my pocket. Now that I have made my weapon, I should attempt attend to my bleeding left hand. Oh, thank you, Dara. Peanut and Mitchnut are 100% stands of that girl. <laughs> I think her name's Ritsu, I think. Because <laughs> uh, she's a cat. I don't know, I'm not crazy about it. She killed Takio, Takio Bell, the best boy who did nothing wrong. He just wanted to get laid, you know? And is that a crime? It's not a crime. He was just down bad. Before anybody else sees, I have to quickly take care of my hand. We're so screwed. I feel like that girl might walk in, I guess, while we're trying to clean up her hand, too. Come on, Ritsu, don't you want to hang out, bestie? Come on, let's hang out. This is most certainly a box. I have to take care of this cut. All right. Oh, god damn. Um, what are you doing? Oh, no, we have to kill him. Ah! He surprised me, Osamu. I'm sorry for alarming you. Oh, oh your hand, you've hurt it. Are you okay? Oh, no. I I'm okay. Why are you acting weird? Did, did something, something happen? Eh, shit, my responses are suspicious. Oh, we're the only person in here, so... Lie about your injury. Is it time to slay? It's a paper cut. Uh, it's a rose thorn from the greenhouse. A, ro a rose thorn, I see. We just, honestly, as much as I want to kill that girl, we should probably just kill this guy, because he's totally going to bring it up later. Then again, they are all Aroha Kennys, so we'll see. A rose thorn, I see. That's why I'm doing first aid. I came, I too came here for some medicine since I'm worried that Maki is feeling ill. Well, then you're welcome to look in this first aid kit. <laughs> oh, really? Thank you. Oh, no. The nervousness. Think nothing of, think nothing of it. Thank you. After Asami said that, he left the room. What did, why did I say that lie? That was so close. God, it really does feel like I'm like the imposter in Among Us or something. If he had seen my weapon, he would have known for sure that I was the wolf. I'm really surprised we didn't kill him. After I wrapped my hand, hurriedly think about what to do next. I longer, the longer I have this weapon on me, the more likely I'll get caught. I have to do something soon! But I'm scared for whoever I choose to kill. What do I do? No, I can't hate this. This time, I'm the wolf. If I don't kill somebody, I'll be killed, and that'll be so sad. I want to stay alive. I want to get out. Did they say the time limit? Is that why everybody's killing so quickly? Because there's like a really big time limit, I guess. Maybe that's maybe that's it. Then if I have to kill, who will it be? Picking a room with a lot of people in it would be bad. If there is a chance, it would be better to pick someone all alone. Let's go look. Okay. I wonder how far we are into this. I guess we always could do like two streams or something. For like three hours. Hey, let me get this back on high quality. Yes, she's here. Let's do it. Let's do it now. Come on. Come on. Come on, Yuya. I know it's you. I know you're crazy. Come on, let's do it. Being the wolf in this game. <laughs> oh, being, I thought she said being the wolf. 
And being in this wolf game is like so annoying. Not even the Kazuna voice can save this girl for me. What should I even do? Maybe there's like a hidden way out or something. Ritsu is the only person in this room. Come on, come on. She doesn't seem cautious at all. Yes, Slay. This could be my chance. I could attack her now. Ooh, I like the music change too. It's good, it's good, it's working out. We're gonna slay, guys. This could be my chance, I could attack her now. Without a sound, I stand up and slowly inch my way towards Ritsu. Oh, here we go. Slay, slay, slay. With a sweaty hand, I reach into my pocket for my weapon. Slay in the bad way, yes! Here we go, just a bit closer. Just a bit. No! God damn you, Rintaro! No! I just want to slay! I just want to slay her, please! Please, Rintaro, I like you. I don't want to slay you, I want to slay her. Damn it! Oh, whew, I'm beat! <laughs> oh, Rintaro! Whoa! <laughs> I'm so tired. I'm so tired. Why? Why are we here just to suffer? <laughs> what are you yelling for? <laughs> so fucking suspicious. Sorry, it's got a got a lot of my mind, you know. Just whatever. That was too close. Honestly, I don't know if double murders are allowed. Maybe, maybe we will do a double murder. I kind of like Rintaro though. He seems sus. My heart is, I mean, I literally know nothing about him other than the fact that like I like his design, but I like him. My heart up until then had been beating maddingly in my chest. Come on, double slay, we got this. It can still work. If Rintaro hadn't shown up just now, then I would have killed Ritsu. You can still do it, bestie. It's not too late. It's never too late. And now that Rintaro's here, it will be difficult to attack her now. Come on, let's do both. Two for one. Anyways, this is pointless. God dang it, just try to find another room. No! Damn it! Damn you! Damn you! Damn you, MC! We were so close! Uh, yeah. Okay, I can't help but wonder what the purpose of this game is. Wish I could make this guy matter. Looks like Ko is wrapped up in his thoughts. Hum, what? Need something? No, nothing. Ko hasn't let his guard down. Even though he's alone, I don't think it'd be smart to attack him. Oh god, are we gonna kill Masaki? Honestly, we might at this rate. I could see that happening since, like, uh, we like her the best. I mean, the char our character likes her the best. I don't really know much about her. She seems nice. Oh god. I can see Maki, though, too, because she's, like, very... She's, like, really weak and, like, I don't know. I feel like she's kind of... She's in despair! Maki is all alone. Looks like she's searching throughout this room and she's not aware of her surroundings. I could attack her now. As I draw closer, Maki's so engrossed with whatever she's looking at, she doesn't even notice me. What is it? What are you, what are you doing? No, not Maki. The other girl. Um, I was just wondering what you were doing, Maki. Just wanna hang out, just wanna be friends. Me? I was just doing a bit of thinking. Oh, oh, were you? Were you doing a bit of thinking? That's interesting. Hey, who do you think is the wolf this time? <laughs> the, the wolf? I don't have any idea. Could it be? She thinks I'm the wolf? Can that really be the case? Oh, okay. Sorry, I'm just I'm just a bit scared. Oh, I feel so drained. I like Maki. I don't want to kill Maki. I want to kill the green-haired girl. Damn it. After saying that, oh no, Maki! No, Maki, don't slay anymore. Come on, come on. You just wait until the green-haired girl. We, we want to kill her. She's the one who deserves it, man. After saying that, Maki turned her back to me and returned to her thoughts. Damn it. Damn it, we're gonna kill her, aren't we? Can I do it now? This fucking guy, dude. I silently approached Maki. Now's the time to do it. Right now. Ah! <laughs> Bruh. Why do we suck so bad at slaying, dude? <laughs> We've gotten caught, like, slaying, like, three times in a row. Oi, you! <laughs> what are you doing? Ah! <laughs> What's with that scream? How depressing. It, it, sh shall we? I, I was just talking with Maki, and I just had this this sharp mirror <laughs> mirror knife in my hand. I was just, I don't know, man. I was just thinking, had a lot of thoughts going in my brain. <laughs> just 
thinking some things. So, you know, running through it. I just, I just like to look at my, I was just making sure my makeup was on fleek, okay? That's why I had the mirror with me, okay? I instantly put the knife away. <laughs> that scared me. Did just now, did Ko? With conditions like these, there's no way I can act. <laughs> this fucking guy. I have to find someone else to attack. <laughs> and if I don't, hurry up. Oh my god. This guy's so obvious, but I feel like they're still not going to be able to figure it out. I don't know. At this point, I feel like we are going to kill Masaki. Uh, Rintaro. By himself. I don't know. <laughs> this guy looks so fucking psycho, dude. He hasn't done anything. But, like, look at his eyes. He just looks insane, man. He looks completely insane. Okay, I guess we can stick with this song. I think it's fine. I love how the song change is so perfect for that scene, too, man. That was awesome. I've been thinking about what this game's true goal could be. The writing on the wall in this room. The reason I've gathered you all here was no accident. Finally, somebody's thinking about this. I wonder what that really means. Everybody else is just too busy slaying. The, the, the sheep are slaying, the wolves are slaying, everybody's slaying. They, no discrimination there. If everybody here is something that connects us all, then what could that point be? What a complexing puzzle. I have no clue what Rintaro is thinking about. It would be hard to get him here. I do not have the brain cell that we all share together right now. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> she, like, got the knives up. Don't come near me! <laughs> Today I will continue to offer my repentance. Ha! Oh, she feels bad. At least she feels bad for what she had. She is yelling in here, and she's wielding some knives. Uh, and she's moving around in such a fast and crazy way. This, if I tried to attack her, wouldn't she just fight back? Even though Chie is all alone in this room, I should just quit here. <laughs> what are you doing in here? We can hear you screaming even down in the living room, you weirdo. You actually feel guilty for killing somebody who's innocent? <laughs> Could not be me. Could not be me, a <laughs> loser. <laughs> what a fucking weirdo. <laughs> What's empathy? Oh, you can hear, came here to see Chie's yelling too? Yeah, I, I heard you yelling too. It's not a show! I am offering up my prayers to the gods! Not to mention that Ritsu's here now. This place isn't good either. What do I do at this rate? I'll never be able to kill anybody! God dang it, I just want to slay, motherfuckers! <laughs> oh, this might be a good song for slaying. I kind of like, I want to slay Ritsu, but I kind of feel like we should slay Osamu since he did see us. Well, I don't know. We've already been stopped like twice almost slaying, so... I feel like we're so obvious at this point. Maybe it doesn't matter who we uh, who we kill. Every time I come to the bathroom, I can't help but but forget what I was thinking about. May as well wash my hands. Turns out a lot of people go to the bathroom alone. This would be a great opportunity for the wolf, huh? Uh, it's a good thing neither of us are the wolf, right? <laughs> right, <laughs> right, my dude. Oh yeah, it's a good thing, good thing. Just. Two sheeps here in the bathroom! I'm thinking about eating some Taco Bell, that's right. Especially in my case. I'm often reading a book. <laughs> Especially in my case. I'm often reading a book, so that'd be really easy to kill me, dude. God, I'm so glad you're not the wolf. Oh, that's good, that's good. Oh, thank you, Kego Kev. Is the wolf among us? We are the wolf right now. <laughs> Actually, we're trying to slay. Oh, man, thank you for the dono. Appreciate you. Oh, man. I better be careful. You be careful, too, all right? Yeah, th thank you. It looks like the teacher Osami would be a good choice when he goes to the bathroom, huh? But if it's just when he's reading, he'll always... Well, he's always doing that. Speaking of that, I should check out the library. Wait, you're not gonna... You're not... He's literally, like... I'm about to go take a dump and read a book. I hope nobody slays me out here. Like, 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 and he's just like, nah, this isn't, no, this is too convenient of a time to murder him. Nah, nah, I'm good. It'd probably be easy to attack, to attack Osami when he's reading. This seemed like the perfect time to attack him, but whatever. Okay, The Wolf Among Us is a game. Oh yeah, I think I've heard about that actually. I like these fish. I like the way they, you know, munch on the dead bodies, the corpses of our fallen, 
fall in her teammates. God, it's so, so relaxing. Looks like Misaki is the only one in here. I could attack her now. Oh my god, Misaki. She's not paying any attention to me. God damn it. This motherfucker. This guy. The girl is staring deep into the fish tank. I quickly grab my... Are you serious? I thought you were like in love with her or something. I quickly grab my weapon in my pocket while I'm keeping it hidden. Damn it. What am I doing? Now I'm... Now... I might not get another chance like this again. But am I really... Am I really going to kill my waifu? Can I do it with these... These hands? No, I can't be thinking like this now. Just gotta do it. Just gotta slay. If I don't do it now. God dang it. Just a little more. Just this poor girl, dude. She looks so happy. She's so trusting. Oh, it's you. Ah, ah, what you doing? Just, just now. Um, nothing. Nothing, nothing at all. I don't, I don't have a knife behind me. No, no worries. I was just lazing around. Oh, okay. I wanted to relax. So I came in here. I'm just a bit thirsty now, so I'm gonna go to the living room. Okay. Oh, that's good. Oh, really? How about I go get you something? Oh, no. You could have. You had an easy way out, man. <laughs> you had an easy way out. Why well, don't I go get, go get you something to drink? Really? Thanks. That would be so great. You are so kind. Oh, you know, <laughs> that's just me, the kind one. It's nothing. Wait here, bestie. I got you. Looks like I wasn't able to act yet again. Damn it, I have to kill somebody, but how can I? I mean, he could... You could still kill her. She's just gonna turn around and look at the fish again. Right in front of Misaki's eyes. Singer killed my... Singer killed my courage to kill her. If I cut her with my knife and mortally harm her... I feel like I could never live with myself after that. That's right. If I could get them asleep! The sleeping pills! If I could prevent them pain, I could kill... If I do it that way, at least then I can make my atonement easier. This dude. I'm sorry, Misaki. I'm so sorry. Oh, he's gonna drug her with a drink, too. Aw, oh, man. It was that moment I decided that I had to kill Misaki. Why is this guy like this, man? Oh, man. It's a medicine box. There's all sorts of medicines inside. That reminds me, he didn't secure you with sleeping meds on Miho. Yep. Gonna do it again. Sleeping pills! If Misaki was to drink these, she'd fall asleep. But could I... Could I really kill her? No, I can't keep getting hung up on that. Yeah, it's kind of interesting. This chapter is, like, so much longer than the other ones. The pacing is kind of... Kind of strange for this game. If I don't kill someone, then I'll die. If I want to kill in the least painful way possible... I can kill them while they're asleep. If I use these sleeping pills, I won't bring Misaki any pain. All right, this will do. Now all I have to do is get Misaki to drink something. I think it's just like, because I was like, is this chapter really that long or does it just feel, feel so long? Because like, the other chapters were so short. <laughs> but yeah, it really does feel like, oh my god, the, the dead body music. <laughs> perfect time, well, almost perfect timing. Okay. Cup of tea. But a cup of tea make Misaki happy. Happy. No, I'm about to kill her. What am I thinking? Oh my god. I have to do this. Maybe I'll make her some black tea before I kill her. If he gets uninterrupted again, that'd be pretty... That'd be pretty wild. Without the... Was that... Uh, without it. Oh my god, I cannot speak anymore. Uh, la, 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 la. With, with hesitation. Hesitation. Cannot... Cannot say anything. With hesitation. With hesitation. <laughs> Why can I say that word? I'm so done. I'm so done. I'm so done. With hesitation in my heart, I drop a couple of the sleeping pills and do her tea. <laughs> and as I do this, I think if I want to live, there is no other choice. Yeah, the MC is not, uh, he's not being chilling right now. <laughs> it's like, okay, I, maybe I killed her, but I also made her like some green tea beforehand. And, like, she was pretty happy before that, right? Oh, you! Misaki, um, here, I made you some tea. Huh, really? Look at how happy she is, guys. That just makes it all worth it, right? I'm so happy. I love tea. Thank you for giving me this. <laughs> so fucked up. After saying that, Misaki slowly raised the cup to her lips. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 
<laughs> what? You say something? Oh, uh, no, nothing. Well, if you're sorry, then you know, whatever. What? This tea, it looks kind of weird. No, you're just imagining things, bestie. I love how everybody's like so smart now. Everybody was so stupid the last two chapters. And one time the wolf, they're like so, they're like brilliant. Every time I do something even like remotely sussy, they're like, are you the wolf? How come it's such a strange, how come it's such a strange color? I used rare tea from overseas. How the fuck you get that in this, in this here killing game? For my special person. Oh, did you say for my special? Oh my god. You really gonna flirt with her before you murder her? Oh my god. I hate this guy. I hate this guy so much. He really said, I'm gonna get, uh, I got specialty for my special person. Dude, my hair looks pretty. <laughs> what I do to my hair, dude? Okay, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> okay. I use rare tea from overseas <laughs> for my special person. Crap, have I blown it? Oh, I see. Overseas teas are this color, huh? First I heard of that. I'm excited to drink it now. Oh no, we're so, we're such assholes. Delicious, you really are good at making tea. Kinda tastes like melatonin. It wasn't that hot, but I'm feeling kinda sleepy right now. Sleeping at night makes me nervous. <laughs> Will you stay by my side? We're awful. Yeah, of course. We're going to hell, man. There's no Mexico for us. I sit down beside Misaki on the couch in the greenhouse, and in no time, she's asleep. I soon hear Misaki's soft, gentle sleeping. I'm going to kill this kid. But should I really kill her? No, I've decided. I have to! I have to! I pull out the knife I've been carrying. Let's do this thing! Do it. Oh my god. Oh, you can choose to do it or not to do it. That's pretty epic. Let's get some let's get some more intense music though. Let's get uh should I do um maybe I should do some execution music or something. Um uh, punishment rocket. Desire for execution. Where's that one? Eh, this might work. Okay, here we go. <laughs> We're going to Hawaii. <laughs> okay, yeah, it's time to slay. Kill Masaki or don't. I think we're all, we all know what we're gonna do. It's time to slay. Let's talk about the MBT music. That's at least what the playlist said. Okay, so we're gonna choose to kill Masaki first. <laughs> Yay, slay. If I don't do this right now, if I don't kill somebody right here right now, I'll be executed as the wolf, and I'm such a great person. The world needs me. I've made my decision. I close my eyes. I raise the mirror shard in my hand right over Misaki. Ready to plunge. But then, oh, okay. We're about to get slayed. I'm setting a rope wraps around my neck from behind. Okay. <laughs> The rope tightening, I feel like it's probably Rintaro. The rope tightening around my throat, I try to fight back. I, I can't breathe. No matter how hard I struggle, the person strangling does not let me go. Eventually my resistance begins to wane as I don't have any strength anymore. We deserved it, honestly. I don't know why they're, why are they killing me? <laughs> like, are we the only wolf though? But why, why would they do it? Honestly though, MC dying, gotta say. <laughs> and her living, I'm happy again. I thought, I thought I was the wolf. It's my, t mom said it's my turn to slay. I didn't even see who it was as I fade away. Probably Rintaro, maybe? He's like, no, that girl's too important. You can't slay her. Okay, that's good. I'm glad we're not killing her at least. Let's kill the green haired girl, come on. <laughs> we know. Okay, we're not gonna kill Masaki, yay. Finally get some humanity back. I can't, I can't do it. I really can't do this. Thank God, she's so sweet. I have to use all my strength to just keep sitting here while at the same time, I'm trying to keep from breaking out in a cold sweat. I'm still grasping the weapon in my hand, trembling. What am I, what am I doing? This isn't me. I may have the conviction of my thoughts, 
But this horror deep in my heart keeps me from making a move. Damn it! Even from the very beginning, beginning, Misaki's only ever been so nice to me. Always talking to me. She's been beyond a good friend. Because of that, I am too afraid and ashamed to ever be able to kill her. Okay, that's good. Have to find something else. The next per- The next person I find! For real this time, I will slay them. I will absolutely kill them. No clickbait. For real this time. I know the music is actually really good. <laughs> the music switches have actually been pretty good so far. Oh, hey, this guy. He is, uh, he's a good target, honestly. Looks like Osamu is the only one in this room. I kind I like this guy too, though, honestly. But whatever. I want to kill the green-haired girl, but I guess we need a villain. Now. This may be the only other chance I'll ever get. Okay. Is it time to slay? Jeez, I gotta act now. <laughs> How many times have I tried to slay in this chapter alone so far? Oh, hey, 420 viewers. <laughs> Once more, I pull out the mirror shard. In order to live, I will. I'm trying to calm myself down, I slowly approach Osamu from behind. He's sitting on the bench on the far side of the room. Is he sleeping? If I want to kill him, now is my chance. My whole body is broken out in a cold sweat. I can't lose my way now. Not for the 16th time in a row. Have to do it in one motion. The seated Osamu still hasn't noticed my presence. Now! Okay, I think I think we might actually... Are we going to slay this time? It's like we haven't... <laughs> We've almost slain like 20 times, so I'm like... Eh, this may be the only chance I have, they say, after the 10th chance. <laughs> I know, right? It's like, <laughs> literally, we've tried like 10 times. I bring down the mirror shard in a swift motion. Maybe he is already dead, actually. That is an interesting idea. Bring down the mirror shard in a swift motion, but then... Huh? What the hell? Is he? Is he already dead? Mmm, what the? I guess they didn't say a sheep couldn't murder. Osamu sitting here is already dead. Dead. Why? Osamu's drenched in blood. Oh, we didn't get to slay though. No. Man, that's so sad. Just from that alone, I know he's dead. But if I'm the wolf, then who killed him? Can it be? There's another wolf besides me? Who the hell? But then, uh, you found it. Oh, a small voice cried out from behind me. What? Oh, wait, is her? Before me stood Maki, still holding a bloody knife. What the? What the fuck, Maki? You're not even the wolf, it's me! <laughs> Before me stood Maki, still holding onto the knife. Did you. Uh, uh, did you see me kill Osamu? You can be honest, honestly. No, Bestie, I didn't! <laughs> uh, well, just now. Uh, <laughs> I'm dead, dude. I uh, what? How are you? I'm the wolf. What? What makes you think I won't kill you too? The fucking execution music too. Um. Well, that's it's already too late. You've seen everything. I have to kill you too. I guess we can just kill her. I guess there's I don't know. There's two wolves, maybe. Maki then started to approach me. We are the worst wolves. Kill me? Hold, hold it right there! I'm the wolf too! <laughs> it's like that Spider-Man meme. We're like, uh, <laughs> pointing at each other. Oh, is this another execution song? Oh, it's the... Oh, it's the Chapter 5 execution song. Oh, I love this one. I don't know, should we leave it? I don't know if it fits, but I kind of like it. <laughs> okay, whatever. <laughs> what? You honestly can't think I'd believe that. It's the truth. I pulled out the wolf card. Yeah, we literally could show each other our cards. I guess there really was no rule about that. I mean, like, literally... Man, I feel like this game, dude. I don't know, man. Like, couldn't they all just show... Like, they're, all the sheep would want to show their cards to, like, prove their innocence. You know what I mean? Like, why didn't they just do that? <laughs> I was just about to attack Osamu. Before I had even noticed... You're, you're really a wolf? Th then what am I doing? I even have proof of it since I just stabbed Osamu. I see. You gotta be telling the truth. <laughs> you were led to believe that there could only... We were led to believe there could only be one wolf. But it may have just been an, 
been an assumed rule from the start. It'd be kind of interesting if we all got the wolf card for one chapter. That'd be kind of cool. It may have been... Yeah, it's not too odd to think. It, it may have just been... May have just been an assumed rule from the start. Yeah, it's not too odd to think there could be two wolves. Well, if we are... Well, if we are both wolves, then either of us could have been the one who attacked Osamu. And by pure coincidence, it's unclear which of us gave the killing blow. What? We didn't give- he was already dead. We- I thought we confirmed that, right? Did we confirm that when we- when we clicked on him? Wait, let me get some more intense music. This isn't intense enough. Oh, I love this one. Da da da! Maybe despair syndrome? This is a good one? Eh, whatever. It's close enough. I get it. We'll go with that story. But what do we do now? So they're just gonna go with that story? Well... Are you really going to help me out? Huh? Because if you don't help me out, I'll have no choice but to kill you here. But if you help me out, I won't tell anybody that you're a wolf. Moreover, with things as they are, there's no room for error for both of us. Rather, my way is the best way. Uh, why? I guess... Your weapon is a piece- your weapon is a piece of the shower room, right? Shower mirror, right? Yeah, but might be a translation error. That's what I was thinking. It might just be that they're planning to say that- It seems like he's gonna cover for her for some reason, honestly. So I guess we're teaming up now. It might be like a slight kind of weird translation thing. Got my knife when nobody was noticing. <laughs> Captain Dragon, I'm about an hour behind, but that was quick. Yeah, this whole game's been really, really quick, dude. <laughs> oh, thank you for the dono, though. Appreciate ya. And I've kept it hidden ever since. You'll only- you'll be the only one- Oh, wait. Ah! It's going so quickly now. I need to maybe slow it down. You'll be the only one to bring up the weapon. And by doing that, you'll avoid suspicion, right? I guess so. Also, there is your injured left hand. You cut yourself when you were taking that mirror piece down, right? Wouldn't that also be evidence against you as well? Eh, then why would I? I think it would be a good idea to work with her. Good. Then it looks like from now on we're working t I guess we're gonna help her cover it up! <laughs> work together. If we work together, we can convince them that somebody else is the killer. Ah, oh, man. Okay, got it. That kinda sucks though, we just gotta blame somebody innocent? That's sad. For now though, we should- where should we hide the body? Um, how about in that closet? If we- if we pile books in front of it, it might prolong discovery for a good while. Good idea. Let's hurry and put him away. I, I don't get the logic, but Slay, honestly, that's kind of me too. I don't know if it's just like a translation thing, but honestly, a lot of the logic in this game I have not really gotten to be totally- <laughs> to be totally honest. We can blame the green girl! Yes! Slay, Slay, Slay! True, 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 true. Frame the child, or the girl who looks like a child, and begin to stack books in front of the closed doors. Well now, we just have to waste time until then. Yeah. Starting now, we have to blend in. First of all, what should we do from here? Just go get alibis, girly, just like in Among Us. I guess we could- oh my god, we could literally like be each other's alibis. And everybody in this game is so stupid, we're definitely gonna be able to convince them. I have a feeling like Maki would frame us during the trial. I could see that too, honestly. I don't trust this girl very much. Okay, but to be honest, this is an interesting situation. Yeah, it is. I wish I kind of understood the logic behind it more, but uh, it's a little hard to follow sometimes. Thank you for the donation, Brian! Maki, after you killed Osamu, where were you planning on hiding him? Well, the truth is, I was so conflicted, I couldn't think of anything. Really? But I was hoping I'd come up with a plan before everyone came in. You really- <laughs> You really didn't have a plan? Oh, we're all Aroha Kinnies here, come on. No, I- uh, No, I couldn't think of anything good. Oh, well. <laughs> the music got all hype again. Let's go back to maybe something, uh, more chill. Um, eh, Beautiful Dead's always a good choice. Okay, and we need to think of something else. There's so many books in here, maybe one of them will have a hint about what we could do. 
Yeah, I've got nothing, so let's try looking. Man, I kind of wish we could have slayed, though. I still can't believe I was just about to kill someone a little while ago. <laughs> that would have been stupid. Was it her that was planning on killing? That was killing me in the other ending, though? I guess that makes sense. Thank you, Bree. POV. You're an imposter in Among Us. Yeah, <laughs> basically. <laughs> basically. Thank you for the dono. Appreciate you, Bree. I clearly did not have my actions afterwards planned out after at all. But I hope that hiding the body in that closet will be good enough, maybe? I shouldn't worry if I don't think of what to do soon. Okay. <laughs> oh, this game, dude. This is... Oh, what the? This is... It says Liar Game. Oh, yeah! I think that's like another one of their games. That one wasn't uh, translated, though. That one... I will say that game did have some characters that looked suspiciously like Danganronpa characters. <laughs> there was like one girl who looked a lot like Sayaka. Another character that looked a lot like, um, whatchamacallit, um, who looked like, um, doo -doo -doo. Hifumi, that's what it was. This is just a liar game. Another one is Studio Wasabi's Games. A short mystery novel. Looks like it has a trick that would fit perfectly for our situation. I didn't think this was like a sequel to it though. I thought it was kind of like its own thing. This alone has a really good alibi trick too. Did you find something good in that book? Clearly the investigation's us trying to cover up the murder. Yeah, I did. Look here. A trick to faking the time of death with fire. And it would also allow us to both make an alibi for us. It, it, it's a bit difficult, but if we work together, we can be... Get the conditions just right. I got it. What kind of trick is it? Well, if we do this, it'll make Osami look like he had been burnt to death instead. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> MC is psycho. Um, wouldn't that be... Wouldn't that be easy to see through? Eh, not for these dumbasses. Come on. They thought somebody got stabbed. She didn't even have any stab wounds on her. But if we cover the body in gasoline first... It will burn more intensely, making that harder. If we set a fuse, it will burn the body at a certain time. And at that time, we can both be in different locations, thus creating an alibi. Honestly, I feel like it'd be better if they were together, because like nobody's going to expect two wolves anyways. Hum. In other words, the time Osamu was burned is what everybody will believe. They'll definitely think that. Kind of reminds me of another murder, <laughs> but there's but there's an issue with all of that. How are we going to make this self-immolating device? Yeah, this book doesn't describe what tools they used. What I thought it would have only been a vague description, but if we're running, but we're running out of time, we have to try this method. We got nothing. Yeah, this is making me uneasy. So you're fine with trying out this method? That will make the time of death look different. Yeah, the only thing is we need to make it look like Osamu's been alive all this time. Oh, about that. I just got a really nice idea we could do. Really? Oh, yeah. Sorry. I got the voices mixed up for a second. Oh, no. Are they going to try to frame the girl that we drugged? Oh, dude. I feel like it could be like that. And yeah, I have no idea how many chapters this game is, unfortunately. Probably like five or six, though. Oh, you know what? Actually, I think it did say on the wiki. I think it was like five or six. Well, if I leave the fire setting up to you, I think it was six. Then I will work on being... Then I will work on keeping Osamu alive for now. Okay. I just hope this will work with your nice idea. Footsteps. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> well, that screws over idea. Shit, someone's coming. I, I want to read a book that I can lose myself into. Oh, God. Chi chi Looks like she's looking for something. Um, we'll finish our discussion later. Anyways, we need to make sure Chie doesn't get close to the body. Okay. Yeah, I guess maybe we can stop uh, halfway through. Should we try to get through the, uh, maybe through like the trial or whatever this time? How long have I been going? Wow, like four hours? Yeah, I was like, I don't know if I can finish the whole thing in, uh, in one go. It would be fun to. But yeah, I might, uh, might have to do the second half later. But maybe maybe we could try to get through the trial or something first. Okay. I wonder if this is an interesting one. It's just that it's so, like, the pacing is so strange for this game. Because this chapter is so long. <laughs> like, com 
compared to the other ones, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> this chapter has got to be, like, I think so far this chapter is probably longer than, like, both the first two chapters combined. Okay, it seems like everybody else is cool with stopping here. Yeah, I'm getting kind of tired. It's been fun. I guess we can do the chapter next time, the chapter three, uh... The chapter three trial? I don't know how much longer this trial is going to be, considering it's, like, way, way longer than... I think we're almost, like, halfway through the game anyways. It's, like, 15 out of 29, so... I guess we can just finish up the game next time, since we're, like, halfway through. It's been fun, though. I don't really know... Honestly, I can't really tell if I like this game that much. <laughs> but, but it's been fun. I don't know. It's, like, I like the concept of, like, the, the wolf game. Well, I like the concept, but at the same time, I feel like... There was more rules that they could have added to kind of like, kind of get rid of some plot holes. Cause I just don't see why the sheep wouldn't show each other their cards. You know what I mean? Cause it like proves their innocence like completely. So it's like, I feel like there should have been a rule against like showing cards to each other. But my main complaint is, yeah, just there's like no characterization. I, or not, not very much characterization. Like, especially the first chapter, it was like, it just died so quickly. It was like so wild. I don't know. I didn't feel like I really was able to bond with a lot of the characters that have died. Besides, besides my boy, Takuya. But this chapter has been a lot longer. I do feel like I actually kind of know everybody. It's just kind of strange. It just like, it feels so strange considering the other two chapters were so short. But yeah, I'm not totally sure what to, uh, what to think about this. <laughs> what to think about this game. But, uh, we'll see. Yeah, it's like I might, um... I guess I'll kind of see what you guys think in the comment section if y'all want me to continue it. I think it'll only take, honestly, like another stream to beat the game. If uh, you guys want me to just switch to something else next week, I could always do that too and just uh, go maybe to like a Redemption Rampa. Because I talked to the creator. At first they didn't want me to, they weren't really sure if they wanted me to play it on stream. Because they weren't like super proud of the first couple chapters. But after I talked to them, they seemed like they were kind of more um, uh, accepting of it. But uh or like more like okay with it, but maybe we could do that game if y'all don't want to finish up this one. But uh, like I said, I think it'd only take like one more stream to finish up this one anyway. So y'all can just let me know in the comments section. Thank you, Brian, for the donation. The concept and gameplay look fun, but the characters are lacking. Yeah, that's definitely the main issue for me. I just, I'm really, I feel like characters are just what makes any kind of story for me. So it's just kind of unfortunate, you know, that I'm... Um, that they, uh, they're so lacking. I just, like, it's like the first girl died and I was like, oh no, what was her name again? <laughs> but yeah, thanks guys for uh, watching. I hope you uh, enjoyed the stream. Let me know if y'all want me to continue in the next uh, stream. Like I said, I'm pretty sure we can finish it. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys later. I should have a uh, Project Eden's Garden video going up this week too, which I am very excited about. But yeah, bye guys. Bye, have a good week.